are you guys doing? Oh man, I've been missing you guys so much. Ah, you have no idea. Oh man, let me change just something here. Hello. Ah. Oh man, you're seeing the bottle? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> How are you guys doing? Today so we are going to play Genshin Impact. Um, for uh, just something to say. Yesterday I was missing. <laughs> I was missing playing so much that I, when I was doing the daily commissions for Patreon, um, well, you know, I, I don't know if you know this, but I'm like doing daily commission in co-op mode. And if people want to join and help me out, I'm like available to do so. I'll, I'll accept everyone that asks for. I'll prioritize my patrons, but you know, if I have free, free, free space and someone is online, they can join. And I was doing the daily commissions and then someone joined and we started unlocking the teleports of Dragonspine. And then I, I was like, huh, I may just unlock every teleport I know. So yeah, I spent four hours just unlocking teleports. <laughs> and after that, I spent time, um, like, uh, seeing the artifacts for each character and, and uh, leveling up stuff. So yeah, when I will continue Beyond the Souls as fast as I can. Well, next Sunday, uh, s next Monday it will return to the normal stuff. Like, I had really university problems, you know? But I wanted to stream this week, even though I couldn't stream before. Um, but I will return to Beyond Two Souls. I'm dying to go back to Beyond Two Souls and see everything. Oh, man. Hello, everyone that's here. Oh, doing the best climbing explorer. I swear. <laughs> All of them. Ah. This feels so good. You guys will see. I unlocked a part of Liu that looks like Dragon Spine, but from Earth. And I have no idea what that is. And I didn't explore the place. I just unlocked the teleports and got the fuck out. <laughs> because, like, I was like, okay, I have to do this on, on live. I have so many things to do on live. We have so many things to do. The event stuff. I reached level 32. So I can do the TCG now. Uh, the daily commissions, the story, the dating simulator kind of stuff. We can get them all. We, we have so much things to do. <laughs> I... Uh, uh. Okay, yeah, so at the moment I'm using these players, uh, these characters right here because like I, I like them. Um, but le let me show you a little bit of, of how we are. Um, so Kole level 10, Beidou 10, Amber 20, Xiangling, Bennett, Barbara, Eliza. But the thing is, I've been doing like... I tried to put every single character with um, artifacts and level up some and I saw their weapons so that way um, if I ever choose a character that I have I wasn't playing like it isn't completely weak <laughs> hello <laughs> um, <sighs> okay we got mail we got mail okay do a survey, get Mora. Yes. Let's go. What year were I born? Born? 2003. I'm female. I don't remember. I'm getting spoilers right now. Oh, I did this. Whoops. They are, they are talking about enemies. Suge oh, awesome. <laughs> She get to Inazuma before the event went? I have no idea. I hope so. How are we here? Log in. Oh man. Okay, so. First of all, what I wanted to do. We have the daily commissions to do. Oh, see? My resin is still recovering. See? I spent resin. Are you going to start the Inazuma quest after teapot? 
Ooh. Yes, let's do teapot. But let me show you on the map. Let me show you what happened. Are you seeing all these teleports? I just haven't unlocked these two teleports on Dragon Spine. These three ones, and then the middle. I guess I I can't go there. But like all the other ones, I got them. And like this is already Sumeru, so I didn't go there. But like I unlocked these teleports. I couldn't unlock this uh, this thing right here. It has a weird mechanism that I couldn't do it at least in co-op. I, I don't know. Um, but I unlocked this. But it's such a beautiful place. I haven't explored it, but it's such a beautiful place. And this way we can do like daily commissions in other places without being monster because it's well I'm getting tired, <laughs> basically. <laughs> um, since this is loading, let me adjust something here um, on the other screens. Yeah, you're hearing the background already, but not seeing anything. Don't worry, I'm not seeing it as well. Okay, so see, look at this place. This is so beautiful. See? This looks like a volcanic area. This is so beautiful. Do I have things to offer? I'm not really sure. I offered a lot of things. <gasps> Holy! Yeah, I have 18. Ahem. <laughs> <coughs> <laughs> Has the best ambience music. I swear. Well. <laughs> <laughs> I got scared when amazed by the child. Yeah, yeah, kind of. I didn't know what those things were. I still don't know. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. A teapot called home. To call home. Navigate. Let's go. Where does it... Where, where does it point me to? Here? Oh, okay. So I unlocked every part of the map almost just to go to the same place. Hello, organic the sus chem. The worst part of Shaz, the underground. Ooh, I haven't gone there. Shaz was created by Geodad. Yeah, it had some weird mechanisms. And... Oh! Wait. And not only the mechanisms, uh, it had some things about lore. But, like, I read some, but I couldn't understand anything of that. It's higher? Okay. It's pretty fun. Hmm. Oh, I'm with Lila right now, but like, let me change to um, the other one because it's a lot better to. Yeah. Next time, be sure to make a proper appointment. Okay. Yanfei shows things, uh, cute things on the map that you can get, so... Ah, children, come, come! <laughs> You've arrived at just the right moment. I've been looking for you. Hello! Oh, what is it, Granny? Need any help? Oh, no, no. You've done so much for Leo Harbor already. I could hardly ask for more. In fact, my old friends and I have been putting our heads together to think of what sort of gift we might give you in return. A gift? For Paimon? <laughs> I only did as I should. <laughs> oh, child. Sorry for the microphone. You are so very modest. Uncommonly so, even. But you mustn't decline this gift. I simply won't allow it. Okay. When you traversed my old teapot in search of the cleansing bell, the I heard teapot. your little friend mention that you often camp out in the wilds. That simply won't do. Especially since I imagine you still have a very long journey ahead of you. I'm going to have a literal teapot? I have not yet grown so old as to see my subspace creation abilities atrophy. Okay, let me explain something. When you guys call uh, the thing teapot, I assume that I wasn't thinking it was a natural teapot like Madame Pink has because she we entered it and it has a whole new world. I thought it was like... 
a house. <laughs> like a house called teapot because of the shape. I don't know. Oh, so, did my yeah. friends <laughs> never mention that to you? Well then, it is a blessing we old folks once received from Rex Lapis. Part of our illumination, if you will. I will not go into too much detail, but subspace creation is the ability to create a small, autonomous pocket Sorry world. Sorry for the microphone. The teapot that you entered previously was a little trinket created using that ability. Mm. What? So, in the eyes of an adeptus, creating a magic teapot world is just child's play, huh? Oh, indeed, the teapot is nothing to boast of. One such as myself must depart from this realm to create a world of one's mm. own. Rex Lapis, on the other hand, moved mountains and seas. That is what one might call an exercise of true power. Huh? But that's enough nostalgia for now. The gift that I have prepared for you just requires a few final materials to add the finishing touch. I can help you look That's for right. them. Finding stuff's what we're good at, after all. Uh huh. Oh, settle down now, children. There's no need for you to go running hither and thither. I have already found a fleet-footed youngster to prepare what I need. Ooh. What's more, I doubt that you would know how to find the materials I am searching for. Some of them are very rare indeed these days. Hey! <laughs> well, for starters, I require some shimmer soil from the banks of Dihua Marsh. Back in the day, it could only be found where the glazed lilies thrived most profusely. You would have to dig downward, following the roots of the glazed lilies. And if you were lucky enough, you just might find a small patch of shimmer soil there. But almost no one has been able to find shimmer soil in this manner since Dihua Marsh came to be the way it is today. Even more difficult to find is Smaragdus hmm. Jadeite, which must be chiseled from the rock of the castle. Yeah, yeah, in it's case, difficult. Smaragdus Jadeite is an Ah, oh, goodness knows if that child will succeed in finding What this child? Well, since you're an adeptus, Granny, the person you asked for help, they must be an adeptus too, right? Hmm, yes. I suppose she does count as an adeptus. She counts? Counts? How come there are so many adepti in Leo Harbor? We seem to bump into them all the time. It feels like even when you go out to eat, you could be sitting next to an adeptus and never even know it. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe so. Who can say? A fair few of my old friends are rather fond of mundane mortal life, after all. I'm back, Granny. Oh, I don't believe. Is she Yanfei? Ah, allow me to do the honors. This child hey! here is Yanfei. She's the one helping run some. Energy. Better call Yanfei. Better call Saul. Yanfei, I believe you've already heard of the traveler and her traveling companion. Yeah. Of course, who hasn't? Much has been written about you in the Millilith's records. Oh. You became one of Liyue's most wanted after the Millilith marked you as a suspect following the incident at the Rite of Dissension. After which, you fought off the Millilith at Julian Karst and made contact with the Fatui before finally defeating an ancient god together with Granny and her associates, and subsequently being cleared of any and all suspicion by the Chising. <sighs> what a shame. A shame. A shame that we didn't meet sooner. Uh-huh. Turn had, back. Well, I can't say that I would have been able to clear you of suspicion immediately, but it certainly would have been less, uh, embarrassing for you. Hello? Allow me to introduce myself once more. I'm Yenfei, a legal advisor. Got a legal problem? You can come right to me. Bro, better call Yanfei literally. <laughs> the reference is too good. You're right, Kamisa Doyato. Oh, yes. Here's my business card. You'll find it has my contact details and office address. Keep it handy. If you have an urgent issue, just leave me a note at this address. Oh, and I almost forgot to mention. I offer a very generous discount for first-time customers. <laughs> all right, Yanfei, all right. Let's get to the... Yeah. You have to excuse Yanfei. She's always been like this. 
ever the talkative one when it comes to her own affairs. Paima was gonna ask the same question. You seem really different from the ones we've met before. An adeptus? Uh, I guess. Kinda. My old man said he was one anyway. He mentioned that he once campaigned with Rex Lapis for a long old time. And then after that was all over, he went back and married my mom. Aww. They had me, and once I was all grown up, the two of them upped and left on a journey, leaving me with Granny here. Ouch. Well, that's a bit casual for an adeptus. Aren't you guys supposed to sign solemn contracts to protect Leo at Harbor and all that stuff? What do you mean he just went back to get married? What's your problem, well, Paymon? My dad did say that he'd talked it through with Rex Lapis and that he was fine with it. Even contributed towards the wedding gift, apparently. Anyway, fine. let's not dwell on that too much. So, Granny, I've gotten a hold of most of the stuff you asked for, except for Smaragdus Jadeite. I couldn't find any at all. Them. Is that so? Hmm. But Smaragdus Jadeite is really rather essential. Hmm. Yenfei, are you sure you can't find some other way? They have helped Lyra greatly, after all. It is only right that they are duly rewarded. I know, Granny, you've told me a thousand times already. Yeah, hmm. yeah. Hold on. Let me have a look. That's a really thick book. What kind of things do you write in there? Commercial consultancy. Or, or, Snezhnaya. Ah, found him. It's Castle. magical. A Snezhnayan merchant who once came to me with some legal queries on certain articles in the legal codices. If my memory serves, all of them had to do with rare ores. He mentioned that he was considering acquiring some Smaragdus Jadeite Ooh. to make hairpins and wanted to know if there were any legal ramifications that he should be aware of. Said he was planning to sell them in Snezhnaya. So, I guess I'll go look for him. With any luck, he'll have gotten his hands on some Smaragdus Jadeite or might have an idea of where okay. we can... Oh, you want to join me? Wow. Yep, let's go. Woo! I even have her on my team. I'm just going to use her. Let me get materials, materials, materials. Hee <laughs> hee. And flowers and flowers. And fish and lotus. He <laughs> This is a really cool place to find materials from Liu. So, um, the place that I had to go, anyways. <laughs> Yanfei is indeed beautiful. Oh. Let's -a go. Oh, they are all playing. How cute. Oh, a chess. Okay. <laughs> oh, we can definitely write this off as incidental gains. Incidental gains? Huh? Crawls. Hello, Mr. Crossel. We kill cards on the Oh, good. Very good. Uh huh. Uh huh. Nice, Miss Yanfei. What brings you here today? <laughs> You're too kind. I was simply doing my job. Now, I believe that the last time we met, you mentioned that you were looking to source some Smaragdus Jadeite to make hairpins. Have there been any further developments on this front? Uh, well, yes. yes. As a matter of fact, uh, in the end, I did acquire a small piece of Smaragdus Jadeite and had it fashioned into a pair of hairpins. Hmm. Miss Yanfei. Might I presume that you have an interest in the hairpins? I must apologize. I have already Rent rented them out to a lady named Zhe Chiao. If you like to respect them, you may Hello, have Sarma. to wait quite some time. Wait, isn't Smaragdus Jadeite really rare? Aren't you worried about the hairpins getting damaged or lost while they're being rented out? No, I'm not worried in the slightest because I signed a contract with Miss Zhe Chiao before renting them to her. Okay. The contract makes it quite clear that if she loses or damages the item in question, she must compensate me for its full original value. Them. In return, I included a clause that guarantees the Smaragdus Jadeite is genuine, with a penalty of ten times the item's value payable by me to Miss Ji Chiao in the event that it is shown to be a fake. Ooh. Guaranteed genuine? 
with ten times. Of course. Okay. This way, both the client and I have the assurance we need. To ensure fairness, each of us has retained an original copy of the contract. Okay. In that case, might you know where Miss Your Child lives? We'd like to pay her a visit and have a look at the hairpins. Uh huh. We're oh, going to steal it. Of course. She wrote her address down when we signed our contract. Here, I'll mark it on your map for you. Thanks a lot, Mr. Crossell. We'll be off now. Let's go! Where's the lady? Okay, she's... There? Higher? Okay. Uh... Is she inside even higher? Do I have to enter? Or is she there? Huh. Lower? Bruh. Oh, 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 box. No, no, sorry, 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 sorry. Where's the other ones? I saw other ones. No, I passed by here. Oh, okay, okay. Hey! So she is lower. Oh, okay. Uh. <coughs> okay. <laughs> Prepare for an hour of legal expertise. Yes, that's me. She lost the hairpins. How do you do, Miss Your Chow? We my associates and I are very interested in them. Would you mind letting us take a look at them? She lost them. The hairpins. I can't lend them to you right now. I I've lost them. Of course. I don't know how it could have happened. I they always keep by my side. So money on them. If I have to pay their original value, there's no way I could come up with that amount of money on such short notice. I'm playing TCG with her right now. <laughs> I, Why do you need him? My family is in the ore business too. We now have a backlog of paid up orders just sitting around. So we've been having to purchase some stock from other ore merchants to complete them. A okay. big banquet is coming up in a few days and several ore merchants I know of will be there. I need this opportunity to mingle and discuss prices. That's what the hairpins were for, to... Well, to keep up appearances. I can't have them looking down on me. But now ben. that I've lost the hairpins... <gasps> we'll find them. Paimon have a sudden Strong. Sense of deja vu? Maybe because this is a part where we say we can help. <laughs> Would you really? I yep. Said, Hold on. Don't run off looking for the hairpins just yet. Miss Your Chow, would you let me have a look at the rental contract you signed? Huh? Well, I mean, sure. Ooh. Let me see. That's right. Yancy said she's a legal advisor, didn't she? True. Those right. I finished reading the contract. The terms are very clear, and they do indeed stipulate that you must pay Mr. Crossell the original value of the hairpins as compensation for the loss. Furthermore, the contract also expressly states that the amount of compensation must take current market prices into account. And given the rarity of Smaragdus Jadeite, I fear that the final amount of compensation may end up being significantly higher as a result. Even higher? Oh no. Uh-oh. However, all of this is assuming that it is indeed genuine Smaragdus Jadeite that was inlaid into the hairpins. Did you really have to pause before saying that? <laughs> anyway, the hairpins are lost, so how exactly would we be able to find out if the Jadeite is genuine or not? Hmm. Whichever way you look at it, we've got... Except that if we found the hairpins, there'd no longer be any need to check whether the Jadeite is genuine, would there? Uh, seems right. Why? Huh? Please. Please, I... Don't trouble yourselves over this. The fact is, I lost the item and I should pay compensation per the contract. So However much it is, I will have to pay it. Marchant. Now, now that it's come to this, I really shouldn't keep cross alone. Yes, legally speaking, it seems this is the most sensible course of action. But before that, I have some questions about the hairpins. Them. So hold on a moment, Mr. Chow. When you first touched the hairpins, what did you feel? Oh, damn! I feel? Well, I remember that the gemstones set into the pins were perfectly smooth to the touch, like the finest quality jade. My family has seen much jade pass through its hands in the past, so I am quite certain of my judgment in this matter. Huh. Hmm. 
smooth to the touch. Finest quality jade. It's a jade! No, it's nothing. I just need to re-examine a few things. Let's head over to Mr. Crossel's. It's fake. <laughs> no, it can't be fake because I need it. Where is he? Oh, okay, it's here. Everyone's oh, problem is a traveler's problem. With this Juchowen. <laughs> About that relates loss of the hairpins. You lost them? Are you serious? Do you have any idea how expensive they were? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Them. Truly, I am. I'll pay the compensation as per our contract. Every last Mora. Mora? <laughs> Do you have any idea what I had to go through to get my hands on that Smaragdus Jadeite? I... I just don't... <sighs> forget it. Talking won't bring them back. Since Miss Yanfei is here, I suppose we can just have her estimate the amount that needs to be paid. No problem. But before I can give an official estimate, I'll need to do a little market research. Ah, yes. And if I may just confirm again, it was in fact genuine Smaragdus Jadeite inlaid into the hairpins, correct? Of course! Genuine article guaranteed, or I pay back ten times the value. Oh, them. All right, understood. I'll conduct some market research, and once I'm back, I'll provide an official assessment of the sum owed by Mr. Chow in compensation. Please wait here, Mr. Crossel. Thank you very much. <laughs> How could she lose my hairpins? She'd better pay every last mora that they're worth. They Looks have to like be I'll fake. Have to find some way to raise that. They have Please to be wait, fake, Mr. Chow. I have something to discuss with you. Yeah. It's not convenient to speak here, so let's find somewhere that we can sit and talk in more detail. And then she goes, yeah, this type of jade isn't smooth. So, you know, it's it's not real. Let's go. Find a convenient place to talk. <clears throat> <laughs> Oops, fuck. I just wanted the patient's meat. <laughs> Kaboom, that's what she said. Hello, Granny. I just like to make people smile. Okay. Oh, let's eat. Miss Yenfei, what is this about? Are you... Are you here to tell me how much I owe? No. Nope. What I wanted to talk about is, there is a chance that the Orin laid on those hairpins may not be Smaragdus Jadeite after all. Ooh! What do you mean? Obviously not. I'm no adventurer, let alone a member of the guild. I don't run thankless, time-consuming errands for a living. Let's just say I made some deductions. Ooh. I don't know if Granny told you this, but Smaragdus Jadeite is found deep underground and contains very concentrated elemental energy. This is better. <clears throat> if mere mortals come into contact with it, well, they'll be sick in the best case, and in the worst case, they could even experience a dramatic change of personality. It most certainly would not be smooth to the touch. Damn. Mr. Chow, did you at any time feel unwell while the hairpins were in your possession? No. No, not at all. Perfectly fine. Uh, hmm. Now that is strange. I noticed earlier that there were elemental traces in Mr. Crossel's vicinity. If I have deduced correctly, he may still have the Smaragdus Jadeite in his possession. Bro! If that's the case, we should go confront him right now and expose his dirty scam right to his face! Fun fact, the guy from the couple which you talked accidentally actually is cheating on the girl. According to the correct quest, basically confirms the elemental message of our radiation. Absolutely not. If we were to confront him now, there's no way he would admit to it. Eventually, he would find some argument to compel us to leave. And then, he'd throw the Smaragdus Jadeite into the sea the moment we were gone. After that, he would simply insist that Mr. Chow pay up per the contract. 
he would lose nothing. Meanwhile, we would have to look under every stone in Liyue, hoping and praying that the hairpins do actually still exist somewhere in this world. So vivid that Paimon thinks it might be experience talking. Oh, it certainly is. I've seen my fair share of situations like this. Well then, since you're so experienced in dealing with problems like this... Hello, I'm Queen x Oh, that won't be a problem. But first, Mr. Chow, can I ask you to please sign this contract? Another contract. Huh? Does there have to be a contract for everything? If I had one more for you. <laughs> I swear I would be rich. It feels like Yante is even more concerned with them than a certain someone else we know. These are my formal terms of engagement. Everything prior to now has just been pro bono advice. But for me to investigate any further, I require a written contract. Ooh. Any work commissioned but not bound by a contract cannot be relied upon. I understand. Then I will be glad to place this matter into your capable hands if you will take it, Miss Yunfei. No problem. Just sign here, and I'll sign too. Okay. Now write your address here, and then sign on this page as well. <sighs> and I'll also need your signatures on pages five. So Payman's dying. <laughs> All right, that should do it. My fees are the same as always, and they're written in the contract. Have a look through, and let me know if you have any questions. My fees? I've had a read through. Everything checks out. Well then, here's your copy of the contract. I will retain the other copy. Of course. I'm the only one that works for free. They don't. She's smart. Not for now, no. Despite how intractable this problem might sound, it will actually be quite straightforward to resolve. Once I don't believe you have been part of an investigation like this before. In which case, hopefully this should be quite the experience. Mm -hmm. Yunfei, I have to ask. Why are you helping me? I need Why? them. Because, as it happens, I'm currently trying to acquire some Smaragdus Jadeite myself. I notice strong traces of geo energy around Mr. Crossel. So perhaps he has, in fact, secured some. Whether he actually made it into an item of jewelry or not is a separate matter. But either way, it's a lead. As long as we follow it, who knows? We might just be able to get our hands on some Smaragdus Jadeite. Yep. Also, the idea of someone abusing... But again, let's not dwell on this. Let's oh, go! Pay a Mr. visit to Shito. Let's go. There is like something in the table that I was dying to get it out. Okay, here he is. Why Once again. There on Yanfei. Surely... No, nothing of the sort. Has a Snezhnayan... A Snezhnayan... Merchant. I do remember that. He, he brought me a piece, me a piece of, of ore? That was the first time I'd ever encountered it. So I had no way of telling if it was really Smaragdus Jadeite or not. But if a customer insists, far be it from me to contradict them. He mm -hmm. was quite generous with his money, too. So I didn't give it too much thought. I processed the ore as per his request. Hmm... Do you have an- uh, Why, yes. It was my first time encountering this ore, after all. So I kept a few loose shavings to study here. later. They're right over there, in fact. Thank you, sir. We'll take a look at them. And they are fake! Fake! Where are they? He pointed it to there. Oh, it's here. <laughs> fake news. My eyes don't deceive me. The cross sections and patterning suggest that these are Smaragdus nephrite shavings. Oh! Yes, it's not particularly rare, nor is it especially valuable. It's used to make jewelry all the time. Oh! It said that Smaragdus nephrite is in fact the outer layer of Smaragdus jadeite, though no one's ever proven it. A thin layer of separation, huh? If you must see for yourself, try examining these shavings for traces of elemental energy. Okay. <laughs> So, did you find anything? Nope. So they really are different. But wait, how come Jichao was able to tell what it was just by looking at the shards? That's pretty awesome. Uh. There's nothing special to it. It just so happens that I've come across a great many of these in my time. Hmm. These two stones actually look very similar. Someone without a deep understanding of them would find it very difficult to tell them apart. But you didn't tell them apart. There may be only a subtle difference for the casual viewer, but that translates to an astronomical difference in terms of the market price. And 
I'm sure. A significant difference in the cost of having them carved into shape. All right, huh? let's focus up. But never mind, Shirto. Why would Mr. Crossell... <sighs> unusual actions have unusual reasons behind them. Let's take some of these shavings back to Chateau. Let's go! Scammers are even in fantasy worlds, I swear. Why am I coming here, you ask? <laughs> because have you looked at the map? It says there's cute things here. <laughs> I got him. <gasps> there's a chest! No, there's a chest! There's a chest! Chest impact, here I go. Woo! Huh. Let's appraise the value on this. Like, I need to find at least two, 200 chests for the mission. Not the mission, for the achievement. Wait! Miss Yenfei? Might I be so I was already on the choir. place. Um, if you could just confirm for me once more, sir. Mr. Crossell did in Portugal. Claim I'm that from the Portugal. Brought to your store was in fact Smaragdus Jadeite, did he not? Uh, yes, that's right. I still have a record of the job with me, in fact. Um, here. It says quite clearly, uh, one chunk Smaragdus Jadeite, uncut. The contracts are making him go down then i have no further questions but could i borrow the processing record and these stone shavings yep of course. because he oh, lied my reasons this document shall serve as sign, sign that these stone shavings originated from the uh or that mr crossell brought to your school. or please read it carefully Hmm, yes. I wouldn't Breathe. say there's been any... this hard evidence to back us up? On the contrary, this is far from sufficient to build a case. Far from need sufficient? To find something a little more compelling. Like what? If you want to make jewelry, you need a professional jewelsmith. Let me think. <laughs> the way she grabbed the book. Jewelry. 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 Ah, got it. Sing -shi. Sing -shi. She often helps... Well, that was quick. Because lots of people come to me for legal advice every day. <laughs> Better call Yanfei. As you know, Liyue Harbor is the city of contracts, contracts. The amendments laws. Made by the team. As such, legal Legals. advisors like myself provide quite the popular service indeed. So Woo. you help them make sense of the law. Hard yes, to well, understand, no, impossible no to finish. Because, uh, you memorized she it? memorized all the stuff? You sound surprised. Knowing the law inside out is a legal advisor's bread and butter, you know? Damn. Oh, this has nothing to do with being an adeptus. I just like reading things. Uh-huh. You and Lysa would be pretty good friends. Again, with that casual tone. Well, that's that then. Let's go look for Sing -Si. Okay, let's go. Where's she? Bom dia, Bruno Palati. Olá, Legends. Yan fez a book inside. Oh, it's her. Oh, Miss Yanfei, it's you. Has something happened? Did the client from last time... Uh... They are exactly the same models. They are exactly the same people, bro. <laughs> She's exactly the same as the one that lost the jewelry. <laughs> Have no further trouble from then on? Yes, of course. I'm just here to ask you a few questions. Has a merchant by the name of Crossel asked you to put him in contact with a jewelsmith recently? You know what, dumb bub? I like damage. <laughs> and they do damage. So I'm fine with it. Crossel. <laughs> yes, I remember him. He's a merchant from Snezhnaya, no? Yeah, he came to me with a chunk of something he called... Smaragdus Jadeite. Uh -huh. The design of the hairpins that he gave me was quite intricate, so it took me some work to find someone who was up to the job. All the jewelsmith. hold for a very long time, and Doesn't recently. Doesn't seem like there's any evidence to be found here. Miss Sinksy, I'd like for you to confirm for me once more. When Mr. Crossell commissioned you to find him a jewelsmith, did he or did he not assert that the material he presented to you that day was called Smaragdus Jadeite? Another contract. Yes, I'm sure of it. The hairpins were made using many expensive materials, 
and the asking price was quite high, so we had to put this transaction on record with the Ministry of Civil Affairs. Contract. Mr. Kosel wasn't very familiar. I also kept a copy for my own records. A copy. See for yourself. There you go. The item is called Smaragdus Jadeite Twin Phoenix Pins. The inlaid gemstone is recorded as Smaragdus Jadeite. The document even has the official seal of the Ministry on it. Thank you, Sinksy. Now, could you let me borrow this document? Sure. It isn't serving much purpose here anyway. I take it then that there's been some more trouble? Nothing yep. you need to worry about. Just a mind. Why is everyone reaction always to assume someone or something is in trouble? Lies. <laughs> hmm. I believe we have almost all the evidence we need. We just need to make one last trip. Let's go to Boobie Pharmacy. To speak with Dr. Baiju. Oh, because the stone makes people sick. If he hasn't sold anything because of that, then it wasn't sick. Hello, Raven Aruga. Thank you for the 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 donation that you did. Hee <laughs> hee. Thank you so much. Weirdo with the snake around his neck. What do you want to speak to him for? Because only he can provide an authoritative statement confirming that smaragdus jadeite is harmful to the human body. There you go. Yep. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go to the pharmacy. Are we? Are we going to see her as well uh, again? <gasps> oh, hello, kitty, kitty. <laughs> Let me explain you. I love catching, so I'm st sticking with her. I like Yoimiya, and she has like the um, archer lifestyle, you know. She she's a really good archer, so I have her. I just got Arataki Ito. And he is like my simp at this moment, so I'm sticking with him. And Yanfei shows me cool materials on the map, so I'm, I'm, I'm with her. So you know, this is basically what's happening. Here he is. Let's go. My, my. to what do I owe the pleasure? Though I'm a <laughs> that if you're looking for our little Chi Chi, she's out gathering herbs. And if okay. it isn't Miss Yenfei as well, now that's an even rarer honor. What business brings you here, might I inquire? Some charlatans peddling ineffectual medicines again, no doubt. His voice is a little bit annoying, but he has the dendro uh, si symbol. So like, when he w when will he come out? On the game because he will definitely come. No, no, I'm here this time to ask if you're familiar with Smaragdus Jadeite. Smaragdus Jadeite? Why, yes, there is some information about it included in the sixth commentary on the seven mount. The seven mountain treatises state that this substance springs forth from stone marrow Ooh. within the mountains and will bring disaster to any mere mortals who touch it. There you go. It is abundant in elemental energy, so if someone without a vision is in contact with it for a prolonged period, best case scenario, best case scenario they fall ill. Yanfei Worst says case exactly scenario, the same thing. Great changes in personality, and their illness will only ever get worse. Huh. Anyway, I'm sure you didn't come all this way just to chit chat. No, nope. I suppose that you're about to ask me to write an official, write an official. Affidavit attesting to the pharmaceutical peculiarities of Smaragdus Jadeite. Yep. That is indeed the case. No trouble at all. It's but after I gave him my reply, his expression shifted to one of remarkable disappointment. I wonder, Miss Yenfei, if your pressing business might be related to this Snezhnayan merchant? Ah, you needn't concern yourself about that, Dr. Baishu. You're too kind. Ooh. 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 So he knows it it's not real. He knows it's not real. Well, we have the evidence we need. Let's go find Mr. Crossel. That's the thing. It's not like he he was trolled. He knows it's it's not real. <laughs> Hello. Miss Yanfei, have you finished your investigation? I trust you will now be in a position to assess the compensation due. Yes, the compensation too hard because you lied, bro. Yes. My investigation is indeed concluded. I can now provide a final figure for the amount payable. Wonderful. Well then, please, 
Could you do the honors, Miss Yanfei? Yes! Of course. Ahem. <clears throat> According to the stipulations of the contract, Mr. Crossell, you must pay Mr. Chow ten times the original transaction price in Mora. Sure. Wait, what? M me pay her? Surely there's been some kind of mistake, Miss Yanfei. Not at all. According to my investigations and the material evidence that we've gathered, the substance claimed to be Smaragdus Jadeite that was inlaid within the Smaragdus Jadeite twin phoenix pins that you rented out to Mr. Chow was, in fact, Smaragdus Nephrite. Now, the contract states very clearly that ten times the price shall be paid should the article not be genuine. Accordingly, you are liable for this sum, which is payable to Mr. Chow in Mora. Material evidence? What material evidence? Why, Miss Yanfei, you cannot frame me like this. I spent a huge sum to obtain that Sparagdus Jadeite, and yet you claim that the ore inlaid on the hairpins is somehow fake? I demand to see your evidence. Uh-huh. Only a testimony from an expert witness involved in the processing of the ore can serve as an authoritative assessment of whether it is genuine. Traveler, please produce the evidence in question. Um... Expert witnesses. Oh, I can choose all of them. Right? Right? <clears throat> if we want to determine whether the ore is genuine, we need to start with evidence from the Jade Mystery. Clearly, you still have a few. Ahem! Is a Sorry. Record from the Jade Mystery, along with stone samples and an affidavit signed by the business owner, Chateau. Seriously? Even the boss there couldn't differentiate between Smaragdus Jadeite and Smaragdus Nephrite. How does this prove anything? In any case, Smaragdus Nephrite is the outer layer of Smaragdus Jadeite. So I had him cut away the Nephrite, he returned the valuable Jadeite core to me, and some Nephrite samples remain in the store. What am I missing exactly? Th that's an unsubstantiated belief. Well, your claim that my ore is fake is just as unsubstantiated. And we are here to talk about evidence, aren't we? Yep. <sighs> Looks like our first piece of evidence didn't convince him at all. Pardon, Next evidence. Something legally binding. We have just the thing. <laughs> this document proves that my hairpins are the real deal, doesn't it? This is the Ministry's seal, after all. It shows that the ore inlaid on the pins is indeed Smaragdus Jadeite. Our second piece of evidence didn't work either. And this guy's getting more belligerent by the second. Hmm. You know, you could be right. Perhaps the hairpins are the real deal after all. But? Of course I'm right. All the evidence shown supports my story. Well, hang on a moment now, because I do recall one final piece of evidence that we haven't revealed yet. Traveler, would you do the honors? What's this? Smaragdus Jadeite springs forth from Stone Marrow within the mountains and will bring disaster to any mere mortals who touch it. Sustained contact with Smaragdus Jadeite over a prolonged period will, in less serious cases, cause a mild malady, while in serious cases, the patient may suffer a dramatic change of personality and fall- Mr. Crossel, were you aware of these peculiar properties of Smaragdus Jadeite? I... I had no idea. BOOM! No idea, you say? Hmm, I'd guessed as much. But for you to have rented out such a dangerous item... I'm afraid that this falls outside the scope of my work, but within that of the Ministry of Civil Affairs. However, I'm sure that the Ministry will be relatively lenient, considering that, as you say, you were ignorant of the danger you posed. Don't worry, Mr. Crossel. I will make sure that all the evidence presented here will be handed over to the Ministry. I trust that you'll give them your full cooperation in their investigations. Oh! What? Wait, wait! I... I knew... Yep, you did. Oh, so you knew? Oh, oh dear, so you Mr. lied? Russell. But if you knew of Smaragdus Jadeite's dangerous properties beforehand, why would you... Huh? No, uh, I... <sighs> the hairpins aren't actually... They aren't? Aren't actually inlaid with genuine Smaragdus Jadeite? Is that what you were about to say? Ten times the price! You do understand, Mr. Crossel, that this means that you will have to pay Mr. Chow ten times the original price in Mora? Mr. Crossel, your answer, please. My client and I are waiting. My client and I are waiting. I... I... Oh. I... Oh. He's seriously intimidating right now. It's like she's a different person. 
That's a legal consulty for you. I admit it. I confess. The ore I had in laid on those hairpins was... Was Maragdus Nephrite. Boom. But I'm a victim in all of this, too. A victim? I invested a great deal of time and money into acquiring that small amount of Maragdus Jadeite in the hopes of turning it into a piece of jewelry that would fetch a fine price. But? But after receiving it and carrying it around for a few days, I started to feel extremely <laughs> I couldn't sleep a wink or eat a single bite. I... I was in a constant state of agitation, too. Radiation? I went to the pharmacy to get myself checked out, only to discover that this sort of stone cannot be worn as jewelry. But how could I let all that money go to waste? Bam. That's why I had another pair of hairpins made from Smaragdus Nephrite, which is almost indistinguishable from Smaragdus Jadeite. Almost. I kept the real Smaragdus Jadeite in a specially made box. I daren't touch it again. Where's the box? I was worried that someone would see through it, which is why I only dared to rent them out, not sell them. And then to top it all off, Chichao lost the hairpins after I rented them out to her. Why did you charge her such an extortion rental price? Exactly. If they were I I didn't want to either, but when I purchased that Smaragdus Jadeite, some of my business partners found out. I knew they'd be watching closely to see how much I could make off it. Wow. If word got out that I sold a pair of fake hairpins, then my days in this line of business would be over. You could always not sell them. Alright, let's cut the appeals phase right there. I failed to see what bearing any of this has on your transaction with my client. Exactly. According to the contract, you must pay Mr. Chow ten times the original price in Mora, and that is final. There you go. Ten. Ten times. You did that. Crusoe looks like he could faint any second. Yep. As for me, according to my contract with Mr. Chow, twenty percent of that sum will go to me. Twenty percent, bro. Better call Yanfei ten of a ten. Twenty percent? That's as much as I spent on that Smaragdus Jadeite. Um, there's no need. It's fine. You don't have to pay me that much, Mora. But it's on the contract. Even if the Smaragdus Jadeite on those hairpins was fake, I still bear responsibility for losing them. Legally or not, I think I owe some compensation for that. Ah, She's being nice. Wow. Uh, <laughs> Ms. Jichou. You... You... However, Mr. Crossel, since you have no use for that chunk of Smaragdus Jadeite, why don't you give it to me instead? I'll consider us even. Oh! What? I... All right, then. This cursed rock's brought me enough grief as it is. Miss Yenfei, I'll turn this Maragdus Jadeite over to you. I trust that it will suffice as remuneration? Yep. Well, um, that's not quite how the rules say this should go. <laughs> but whatever. It'll do. Okay. Thanks so much for your help this time, Miss Yenfei. When you have the time, I'll be sure to visit and express my thanks more appropriately. Okay. Oh, come on. No need to stand on ceremony. Now, if I may confirm this again, Mr. Chow, have you and Mr. Crossel come to an understanding? Now sign this contract over here. Mm -hmm. Well, yes, I believe we have. Well then, that's good. Mr. Crossel, it seems that my client has no further claims against you. Her face is like... Is... is that so? That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Actually, Mr. Crossel, I'd like to talk business for a second, if I may. Business. After this, they, they marry and have children. <laughs> I can see from the hairpins you produce that you're very skilled in jewelry design. My family, on the other hand, works in the ore business, and we have a fair stock of fine ores. They even do a partnership? If we could join forces, your jewelry designs and our choice ores, I think we could do some fine business between us. Bruh! Uh, let me think for a moment. Just say yes, bro. She just asked you to marry her. <laughs> well, that's that. And this Maragdus Jadeite that Granny wants too. All's well that done, ends. Well, eh? Though there were some twists and turns along the way. Exactly. Usually when someone tells us they've lost something, we end up searching all over the place for it. 
But this time, you managed to solve the problem with just a big stack of documents. Just a big stack of documents. <laughs> didn't involve actually finding the hairpins. Yeah, we, we would find them. The right solution depends on your perspective on the problem. Oh! The objective of my client, Mr. Chow, was to reduce her liability to pay compensation. So, rather than looking high and low for some hairpins, proving that the rented item was nowhere near worth what the vendor had claimed it to be was the more efficient solution. Can't say I've never met an adeptus like you before. Adeptus. Speaking of, you took Liyue Harbor is now a city ruled, ruled by, by humans. The title of adeptus means precious little to me compared to my job as a legal advisor. Sure. In any case, don't you think that the Liyue Harbor of today needs legal consultancy far more than it needs adeptal powers? Out. Hyman can think of someone who would definitely disagree with your reasoning. <laughs> well, since we got what we came for, it's time to pay gra Granny. Let's go. Let's meet Granny. I got the rock! Did you see the guy just saying I'm bored? Bro, everyone is looking for me. Look at their heads. They are all like uh, traveler, traveler, traveler. Uh, but I'm ping. But I'm ping. It's all good and empty. Adepti. <laughs> the true way of exploring. <laughs> Hello, Granny. Here's the rock. Ah, you've returned. That's how, how you know. You go? Were you able to yep. Good, good. Well, All the materials set, we need. I'll get going now. Got a ton of clients waiting for me back at the office. <laughs> Better call Yanfei. Oh, you. All right, then. I'm off then. Bye. Bye. Oh, yes. Traveler, make sure you don't lose the business card I gave you. Don't worry. I've been looking into the laws of other nations as well. If you should ever bump into any trouble with the law, come find me directly. Regulars get discounts too. <laughs> if you're the first, if, if this is the first time, you get discounts. If you are regular, you have discounts as well. Come now, child. Are you leaving or are you not? If you oh. wish to leave, perhaps you'd like to help me clean my teapot. Hmm? And she's like, ah, no, I have so much to do. Bye. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. <laughs> <sighs> that child. Goodness knows where she learned to be so rambunctious. Ah, indeed she is. Liu has changed. And the Adepti must also learn to change. Yan Fei might be overly garrulous, but she is also the most How old is Madame Ping? The city among us all. Ah, uh, Liyue is not the same place I once knew. Oh, Granny. All right then. Uh, let us. Oh, yep. So Give me a teapot. <laughs> it is but a single teapot. It shan't take long at all. Just wait here for. Eighty-seven, a five thousand years. She's oh will I I have the team <gasps> There we go This serenity is <laughs> now hold it firmly Take these blueprints with Blueprints you. thank you oh, bye you No 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 little helper Yeah Select them real? I, I can select them all. I can I? Colizal. Do you wish to settle no? Yes? No. Rocks? Uh Emerald Peak. Uh. <gasps> Ooh. Load nothing. nothing Good dig. A burrow to live for it, I guess. 
You could crave us a whole house out of these rocks. Empty. There's a helper. Oh, this is so cool. I have I have things. Oh, I have things. <laughs> hello, hello. It seems Oh, hello Magiare. I just got the teapot. I opened it, the teapot. It's a huge finch. Hello. Excuse me. I am not a finch. Teapot spirit. Um, hang on a mo Supposed to be called Call me Tubby. I suppose okay. you may call me Tubby. Okay. So you're the little little one. helper, Madam Ping. Oh, you must mean Ping. Yes, she did summon me here. She Ooh. told me you may leave all matters regarding the upkeep of this realm to me. Your journey may be far from over. But at least this way, you will not want for a comfortable place to He sleep talks too tonight. slow, bro. <laughs> what is this Though teapot it is spirit? The Adepti who create realms such as us, we teapot spirits were created to help guard their realms and manage their affairs. You okay. may consider me a butler. A butler. Oh! Have you any blueprints on you? Yep. As long as you have a blueprint, you can refashion this realm however you please. Okay. Oh, yeah, she gave us. Look at him. Yes, these okay. are the blueprints I'm talking about. Go on. Just commit Open? the image of the objects to memory and prepare the necessary materials. Ooh. Then simply release the thought from your mind and the object in the blueprint shall appear within this teapot. Release the thoughts from your mind? Can I do that in real life? I want money. <laughs> wow. Yeah. We can build a whole city inside. Can there. can can people visit each other teapots? Can I do co-op and people come to my teapot? Yes. Hello, little Kiki. Yes. Ah, that's that's so cool. The adeptus explained this to me at some point in the past. He said. That this world is not a, a golden eye. I hardly remember myself. Well, let's not dwell. If there's anything, <laughs> look for Tubby. After using some of the about this way with that girl, like with the other one, talk to the one to the other. You can create all kind of item. Whoa! A tool can be used to create a castle. A place for it to increase a depth of energy rank. Of this area, but that they are increasing the real currency will accumulate as a fact. Realm currency? Spend real currency and depth to the pots. Ooh. Wait. Work life balance, but I think this is pushing it. Furnishing to increase once in a while. Keep a travel salesman will visit you. Oh, oh, I've said help with the you of all the turns. I will be Okay. Hey! Oh! <laughs> Hello, The Sims. Is that you? Building? Huh? I have a lot of. Pl no. Uh, uh, uh. How do I. Oh, okay. I want. Oh, ah. Oh, I'm getting Paralives vibes. Although Paralives is still not here, but you know it will be. Ooh, confirm. This is the main building. Animal? Animals? I can have animals? I can place Paymon? <gasps> I have a Paymon there.
Yeah, I have nothing here, probably. Save chances. And I have a fame on! The load thing will annoy you when building. Forge? I can forge cool things. I want to forge cool things. I have a cool book. Now I can't forge other things because I don't have iron chunks. <laughs> it's fine. I can cook too. Could I could I cook here? Nope. No, I can't cook here. Paymon? Nope. Nope. Rock, paper, scissors? We should get something tasty to eat. Ooh, okay. Super Paimon Tornado! What? Rock, paper, super planning tornado! I can't. Oh, I can enter. I can enter. <gasps> this is my house. It has doors. <gasps> this is a bedroom. This is another bedroom. This is another bedroom. Or oh, this. Or. Or. I don't know. We can have here the living room. There is the kitchen and things, dispenser and stuff. This is the corridor. You can have a, a huge dining table. And where's the bathroom? I need a bathroom. Oh, this is like one of the main bedrooms. Yeah. This is for my kids. Ooh. Everything's a bedroom. <laughs> yes. Oh, where's the door? Where's the door? Oh, okay. The door is here. Okay, okay. <laughs> This is the door. No! No, the table is not for here. This is a bedroom. Wall decor. Yeah, one of the bedrooms downstairs can be Paymon bedroom. With card changes, I have nothing. But I have trees! I have trees! Okay, so... Um, um, this is like kitchen and stuff. I, this will be the place for, to have the table. Where's, where's the place to have, where's the table? Okay, here's a table. <laughs> Where are, um, save changes. <gasps> I have a table! But it says, it says I have more stuff. Use. Oh, I learned it to create stuff. Now I have it, right? No. I learned it to create, but I can't create. How can I create? How can I create? Oh, I learned another, another thing. Ooh. I have a, a rug, a welcome rug. How do I make things? Talk to Tubby? Okay. Let me talk to Tubby. You can craft with the bird outside. He. Hello, Tubby. I want to craft. 
Maybe you. Ah! Trust rank. <gasps> oh, you have rank and bonuses. Claim rewards. I got even more stuff. Oh. Uh, uh, red dye? How do I get red dye? So you you need a lot of dyes. Oh, here. Okay. Oh. <laughs> that won't be a problem at all. Oh, I can use a lot of uh, different materials to create the same thing. Yep. I created one. I only created one, Lamo. <clears throat> so now I'll create 49. <laughs> And more fifty and more fifty and fabric. <laughs> I created so many things. Conversion material. Oh. I can cook here. No one has bonuses. No one else should have bonuses. Fourteen hours. I shouldn't use this kind of things like this, you know. <laughs> Creation time, 14 hours. It's everything 14 hours? Bruh. Shame. Well, anyway. Realm Depot. Ooh. I can buy stuff. Buy those Insta Create potions. I can buy insta create potions. Frog and Cedar. Ooh, I want this. Furniture blueprints. <gasps> I can do a bedroom. No way. I'm not going to spend my money on that. Jay's Field. <gasps> you can create you can have a garden. Hidden in chests. Ooh. If you ever <laughs> so <clears throat> Welcome to my house. We enter. Yeah, yeah, we're looking this backwards. So this will be like kitchen and stuff. And I said this would be like, oh, I can't place it here. Okay, okay. But maybe. Why can't I place it here? 
down the stairs. Is it bad for you to be it down the stairs? Okay, but I can place it here. This is the storage. And we have a rug, a welcome rug that will be here. And we have a chair. This table looks sad. So we have a chair. We'll place the chair here for now. And I want a light. I, I could do a light, right? Yeah, I could do a light. So let me do a right. I hope the Lord will does have fun annoying her. There's a load limit? Maybe you're not used to the place. <gasps> Bro, shut up. For real? Yo, Mia is like re very good on decoration. Refund a portion of the materials used? Um, yes, please. <gasps> Rank two! Rank two! Ha! See, I got even more things. I got Primos! Can you sit? Furnishing blueprints. Wooden bench. Another house. If you ever... Oh. oh, this is so cool. Wow. No, 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 no. This is really big. Mm. I was expecting this to be a little bit smaller. Huh? In their sets.
<laughs> I have house. Ooh, I have storage. And I have a teapot. I got chairs! have so many things claim Companion? Companion? What do you mean, companion? Two? Hello. Hmm. Looks like you're pretty free today. If you're asking from the perspective of comfort, I like it very much. But in my professional opinion, I think there's a lot of potential here that's not really being fully utilized. I mean, for starters, you don't even have to worry about mitigating natural disasters, or any other external risk factors for that matter. So that makes your land use planning process a whole lot simpler. The main consideration for you is how to make the best use of the available space. Beyond that, you really want to think about the proportional allocation of resources. Uh, uh, don't mind me. I slipped back into work mode. <laughs> Do whatever you like. It's your home, after all. You should be the one to shape it. Hello. Hmm, looks like... Sure, why not? And though I should warn you, most people aren't exactly enamored with my conversation. Well, for example, a colleague once asked me, is there anything I can help you a with? A colleague! Packaging? To which I replied, you can start by worrying about your own work rate. Oh! After that, they never approached me again. <laughs> Another person asked me, do you have any gift suggestions for Lady Mingguang? To which I replied, don't bother, Mingguang has no time for suck-ups. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, so now you know. I don't think I did anything yeah. bad. 
I just think if you've got something to say, there's no point mincing your words. Okay. Sugarcoating the facts, kind lies. It's all a big waste of everyone's time. Still doesn't pick up lots of side effects. Exactly. See, you understand where I'm coming from. Mm. I was right all along. We've got a lot in common. Ah. <gasps> uh. Hello. Hello. I'm so happy to see you again. Can I do anything for you? I'm at your service. How do you like I love it? the atmosphere here, as the exterior is spacious and very pleasant, and the interior is exquisitely decorated. I do believe it's the finest estate I've ever seen. The only problem is, compared to Mondstadt, there's far too little here for a maid to do. Aww. It feels a little too relaxing. Aww. This is so cool. Maybe you're Folding script Vimora, is this you? Outdoor tea table? Toy stand? Of course I want a toy stand. Let me have a toy stand. Fifteen? It's fine. It's fine. Uh, no! <clears throat> oh. I remember I first put the screen one, two, four, as it's full seat. No, I don't care about our ranking up. I want I want to decorate my teapot. I have a teapot. A teapot to call home. A place for the books? Oh, I should have one. Creation is full. Is 
If you ever have <laughs> So if I enter This will be my Study room? I don't know how you call it in English No, 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 this is not for here No No, 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 no Can this be on top of the table? <gasps> Maybe this can be on top of the table. Maybe this can be on top of the table. Maybe this can... Huh? On CD? Placing furniture. Ha! Huh. Oh, the rug is too small. Hey! Is this red because we can sit on them? Like, can I not sit on the others? Let me see. Yeah, I can't sit. I can sit on this one. Okay. So let me... Ooh, red means too close from the table. Well, you sit like this on real life. Guys, we can eat together now. No. This has a Sims 3 um, mechanism to view the game. I don't like that. Why can I only have two? Like, that's literally not fair. <sighs> I have a teapot. A teapot to go home. <gasps> the cat! <laughs> Brr. Eight max. Okay, I can deal with eight max. Hey! Huh? Guys, I have a teapot to call home. Is that a teleporter? I can do things outside as well, right? I think I could. Oh, yeah, I have. This as well. I have rocks. I have trees. Hey! Didn't I have th 
things. Ooh, I have this toy stuff. Outdoor set. I'll have a much more beautiful tree one day. Play Free Fire? Honestly, the name is really familiar, but I don't even know what the game is about. It would be like a first time playing Free Fire. <laughs> oh, it has rocks! I'm overly decorating only one part. <laughs> and like not caring about the others. The others are not important. Shut up. Ooh. There's a teapot. Is it my teapot? No, no, no. Fuck. I'm just happy. I have I have a place to sit with you guys now. Here. We can all sit and have tea together. A tea? We can have tea inside the teapot. There is a second teapot spirit. Tubby and Shubby? Cozy! It's cozy. I wanted to do a light for our outside space. I don't have wood. No, I do. It's one. Yeah. If you right. ever. Nope. Goodbye. 
Chubby is amazing if you want to build land, a house on a hill or in a mountain. Chubby is the best. Ooh. The light is for the inside. Oh man, it looks so nice. I have such a beautiful teapot. Oh, so this is for inside. No, I'll leave it by this side. Okay, now let's go to our stuff and on CD. I don't understand what is the on CD. No, 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 no. Has to be on this wall. Yes. He okay, looks nice. Okay. Oh, look at my map. Monster? Oh. Ah. You can use Zito to get double the three materials. Wait. Ito Ito gets double the three materials? Yeah. Um definitely. Now, let's do Something honestly. Oh. <laughs> this is Genshin Impact. <laughs> it's the Traveler in Paimon. What a nice surprise. Hello. Oh, and Sucrose the Alchemist. It's been a while, hasn't it? Yep. I'm afraid I've already told you before. I passed it, but did you see how... No matter how much more you offer... Bro, did you see how she became Sucrose? was like... <laughs> she was so like... Oh, yeah, it's been a while. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Margaret. Look at I'm her. I'm not here for that research project I told you about last time. Research project I told you about last time? Ooh. Ooh. ooh, ooh um. Uh, Sucrose, what kind of experiment were you trying to do with the cat scale? Exactly. Uh, oh, I just wanted to test out some hypotheses, and I needed some materials. But, uh, we can talk about I love later. cats. Actually, Margaret... We're here to learn more about Genius Invocation TCG. Yep. So Crows explains everything to Margaret. Ah, Genius Invocation. Yep. You see, more and more people have been. Ah, oh, meow. Me to interpret. <clears throat> Prince says that the word customer Prince? is much too loose of a term, and we should instead refer to anyone who loves dueling with cards as TCG players. Hmm. <laughs> My mistake. The cat talks. So it seems no, it I doesn't. Haven't introduced you yet. This is Prince and Shuyin. They will be in charge of taking care of our TCG players. Ah, I'm afraid I must correct you there, ma'am. Only Prince, the strongest and most formidable TCG player of all, is capable of providing valuable guidance to our Prince new players. Prince is a cat. The average player is incapable of grasping the subtlety and sheer genius behind Prince's every play. And he has no choice but to rely on me to communicate with everyone. I am merely Prince's lowly assistant. That's all. Wow! 
Another guy you can understand animals! How can you use such a crude word as animal to describe the one and only prince? He is special and the only one of his kind. Such a remark is an insult to prince. Meow. Oh, what's that? <laughs> Shu Yen. In the eyes of the common folk, I look no different than any other ordinary cat. It's a natural mistake to make, and you shouldn't overreact. Ah, understood. I do apologize. Cat. Mew. Shuyung. Shuyung, in the eyes of the common folk, I look no different than any other ordinary cat. It's a natural mistake to make, and you shouldn't overreact. <laughs> It seems he really is capable of communicating with the cat. Could this be the result of some modification to the language center of his brain? Hmm? Seriously, how can he get all of that from a simple meow? Mm. It was the duels of genius invocation TCG that allowed our hearts to bond. Mm -hmm. It's understandable that ordinary people such as yourselves are unable to comprehend such a thing. I'm sorry? So... Playing Genius Invocation TCG fosters some sort of a telepathic link between players? Hmm, somehow Pylon doubts that. Uh-huh. Anyway, if you'd like to know anything about Genius Invocation TCG, then please ask Shuyan. Uh, who will ask Prince? Though I'd love to explain more myself, it's time for my daily walk. I'll let Prince play a game with you and walk you through all the rules. Let's go. Just as a seasoned warrior can foresee the path of his opponent's sword, so too can I, as a TCG master, predict my opponent's every play. <laughs> it would be improper to pit a newcomer to the art of the card against one such as myself. And I must therefore politely decline. <clears throat> That's what Prince said. Oh, Prince doesn't want to play with us, huh? Then Prince doesn't have to. We'll play you instead. Oh! I'm sorry, but from the day I met the mighty card master Prince, I swore an oath that my hands would live solely to hold the cards and not to play them. I will never play another match of my own again. If Prince is unwilling to play, then I guess we should look for an alternative. Hmm. <gasps> How about this? Diana? Diana? Blah, blah, blah. What is it? I'm pretty busy over here, you know. Bro, you're underage. What are you doing near all those weird bottles? Bartender cat sales. Hates all alcoholic beverages. <coughs> Has a rare ten talents for bartending. Damn. <coughs> Is it that every player that sets foot near to play Genius Invocation TCG has to have a drink? <laughs> Ugh. Don't they have any clue that the key to playing a game is the ability to think straight? <laughs> Seriously, games and drinks don't mix. Don't they get that? Ugh. What can I say? As the tavern owner, I can't help but feel happy to hear this. <laughs> anyway, I see you've been working hard, so I thought you could use a break. So, why not come over here and teach these customers the rules of genius invocation? Ha! Ha ha! Yeah, what kind of break is that? I'd rather not. <laughs> I'm sorry! Oh, why are we letting all these loafers come in here to play genius invocation TCG anyway? All it does is encourage more people to come to the bar for a drink! <sighs> you know, if drink sales keep going up like this, Pretty soon, Mondstadt's alcohol industry is going to reach new heights. You know your god. <sighs> Looks like my first step in destroying Mondstadt's alcohol industry should be stamping out the spread of Genius Invocation TCG. <laughs> my dear, you are quite mistaken. You said it yourself, a clear mind is necessary to win. Soon, their thirst for victory will overcome their thirst for alcohol. Prince speaks the truth, Diona. 
Not only uh -huh. the spread of genius invocation TCG, no obstacle to your goal of just could, could it Yeah, really? okay. Sure, why not? Shuyan. Okay, we got it. Go to the empty table, learn the rules. Yeah. Can't catch me. Let's go. <laughs> okay, let's do through the rules. First things first. You'll be needing your deck, so place uh uh yes. You should have built a deck. You know, a set of cards that meets the bare minimum requirement to play the game. Uh -huh. hmm. What's with the blank stairs? Come on. Hmm. Don't tell me you came to learn genius invocation TC. We do have three. some. That's right. We have some cards that I received from a friend. Uh, mm -hmm. yeah. You're gonna need a few more cards than that. Okay, let me think. Oh. <sighs> To learn two, character game, two character cards. Diana and Scrolls. We got oh, the two oh, of that them. That reminds me. A few days ago, when I was closing up for the night, I noticed a customer had left a couple of character cards. Are you sure that? Let's it's go. Oh. Okay, yeah, I got the. All right. So now, yep. So, I are ready. Let's right. go. Then let's begin. Okay. Diana's biggest enemy is Diluc. Yeah, I can see why. <laughs> Welcome, welcome to the world of Genius Invocation TCG. I'm with Kai and Diluc. Oh, they look a lot alike near each other, though. But yeah, Diluc. Simply put, this is a game where you control character cards to duke it out with your opponent. Pew pew pew. <laughs> Once you've defeated all of your opponent's character cards, victory shall be. Yours. Okay, Diana's father, I think, was always drunk and she hates his alcohol since. Makes well sense. Then. You're gonna need a character on the field to start with. I, I have the look. Let's Confirm. Swiftly. You attack first. First, we roll eight elemental dice at the start of every round. Okay. Ooh. Correspond to elemental Until energy. E we'll be spending these dice to perform actions. Action phase, your turn. Once the roll phase is over, you'll enter the action phase, where the real game starts. Okay. During the action phase, you can spend elemental dice to perform various actions. Of course, the most common action is to use character skills. Deluxe elemental skill will cost three pyro dices. After selecting the skill, you will select the elemental decimals. Me by default, serving can deal three pyro damage. Oh! <coughs> My opponent. After you use a skill to attack your po it's their turn. Oh! As you can see, once well, the enemy finishes their move, it it's your turn again. Okay. Ooh, two Omni dice. Now, Among us. these are Omni element dice. They can be spent on any move regardless of the elemental type. GG. So we're gonna use let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Woo! I could, I, I, I could like spend it <laughs> better. pretty good. But the game has only just begun. Defeat all opponents to win. Ouch. As much as we'd like to attack again, seems like we've run out of usable dice. Yep. Huh. In that case, let's end this round. Round? After you end round, you won't be able to do anything else this round. And once everyone chooses end round, we can move on to the next round. Okay. Um. Yeah, I can't do anything. End round. Okay. Yeah, it's 
it may be obvious later, but uh, the the guy did spam. And a fresh new round means time to roll the dice again. That's I just we're gonna get the elemental energy we need saw the all. things. Okay, roll dice. Ooh, that's some terrible luck. Well, there's no way we'll be able to use Diluc's skill now. But don't worry, situations like these are why we have the option to re-roll. <laughs> Once per round, you can select all the dice that you don't like and re-roll them. Can I like re-roll every single one of them? <laughs> okay. When the action phase begins, this means that yeah. you're all ready then. Let's learn a little bit about energy and elemental bursts. Okay. Each time you use a skill, your character will gain one energy. Yes, it's here. Once Diluc's energy is full, he can use a powerful elemental Ooh. burst. But we're still one short. Never mind. Let's start with a normal attack instead. Normal attack. Diluc's normal attack only needs one pyro die and two other dice of any type. Okay. In any case, your normal attack needs fewer pyro dice than your elemental skill. Just like elemental skill, Grant. <laughs> he almost dying. <laughs> now we have three energy. It's time to use. Your powerful elemental burst! Yeah, let's go. Burn. Ooh. <laughs> Anna Paula, why the fuck are you doing that? <laughs> So I probably think it's funny to spam the chat. <laughs> Sorry? Okay. So now it's like... You attack first. In an actual game of Genius Invocation TCG, you need to use multiple characters to form a Of course. Next up, it's time for your second character card. Kaya to take the stage. I don't want to use Kaya. Oh, it seems like any move by Kaya is going to cost quite a lot. So, uh. Sure. Okay. But I'm the one choosing. Like, the other person has other dices. So it's Kaya's skill. Yeah. Dodge this. His uh, music. Good. Now our opponent is affected by cryo. This is a good time to learn different elemental types of reactions. And elemental react at the moment. Oh, that reminds me. Both sides must have one active character, while others are considered standby characters. Hmm. We are more forward position. Normally. We can only use the active character skills. Now, if we want to use the skills of our standby character, we'll have to switch them to the active character. Okay. In this case, we'll have to switch to Diluc in order to use his skills. Look at her. We have to switch to Diluc in order to use his skills. We can see the hate right on here. You can spend one elemental die of... Let's go. Let's go. Switching characters is an action just like using a skill. Yeah, whatever. It's my, my turn. My can only target the active character. As you can see, your opponent just attacked Diluc. All right then. Now that Diluc is our active character, it's time to use his skill. Because the opponent went triggered, Meld increases di- This will allow you to deal loads of damage and- 
I have played TCG before. Thank you, Diana. Victory! Third action cards and support effects. Oh, okay, this is interesting. Paymon help? Nah, bruh. Action cards. Each time a match starts, you have to draw five action cards to form your starting hand. Uh oh. Looks like we don't have any elemental dice we can spend to make an attack. Oh, damn. Guess we just have to reroll them all. <laughs> ah. I I don't have any. Um. We still don't have any usable dice even after that reroll. Well, huh, never mind. Even in cases like this, <laughs> we can it's still. It's like oh, attack. never mind. We just need to put the action cards in our hand to good use. Okay. Underestimate action cards. Okay. All kinds of support and buffs to your active character. Guess one, we'll have example. to reroll them all. <laughs> so Great iron sword. Card will require two of these. Uh, see the symbol? Yeah. That means you'll need to play elemental dice of the same type. Huh? Some other cards will cost you these instead. Ah. The cost requirements for these are much more lenient. You can spend any kind of elemental dice. We'll cross that bridge when we get there, though. For now, just play this action card. Yeah, I don't know where I have it. We need to spend two elemental dice. Of the same type. Okay. Play card. Play two of the same cards. Select a, char a character to equip Claymore. I have. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, playing an action card from your hand is a form of fast action. Fast actions do not end your current turn. Simply okay. put, you can continue to act even after playing an action card. Well then, <laughs> you have your blade. Time to test it out. But wait, okay. D Luke's elemental skill cost three. Well, not a problem. This is where we can use a more advanced mechanic known as elemental, elemental. turning. So by discarding one card from your hand, you can convert one elemental die into the element of your current active character. And huh. this card isn't useful right now. So we might as well use it for elemental tuning. Paymon. Fuck. <laughs> I was like, Paymon is the one useless, but no, apparently not. Soon one elemental die to turn into pyro. Huh? Select a die to transform. Sometimes you won't be able to perform any actions you want to because you didn't roll the elemental dice you wanted. Oh well. Moving on. Ingenious invocation. I'm confused. TCG. Keeping up a constant flow of combat is much more important than the number of cards you have. In this case, well, <laughs> let's just take all these useless cards and she use is, She is emergency tuning. sacrifice? Just like playing cards from your hand. Elemental tuning is a fast action. Come on, hurry up! Use elemental tuning to get yourself three pyro dice. Elemental tuning to get three pyro dice I can do as much as I want well, 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 would you look at yeah 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 come on because no 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 fast 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 great sword equipped searing onslaught will deal one extra damage what what <laughs> <laughs> yay is it done is it done is it done Okay, it's a final test. It's a final test. It's a final test. The final part. Oh yeah. In a real mat at this time, we can select any number of cards in our hand to shuffle back into the draw pile and then draw the same number of new cards. What? 
<laughs> She's so funny. Yeah. Um, this card is really interesting. Once you have confirmed any adjustments you wish to make to your starting hand, both players have to select their starting active character at the same time. Oh boy. Let's see how you do this time. Remember, start Yes. Let's go. Let's go. You attack first. I attack first. Roll face. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, I have two pyros. I could re-roll the ones I want to re-roll. So let me re-roll them all. Roll, select dice, re-roll. I select. Whoa! Cool! Okay, 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 okay. Your turn. It's my turn indeed. <laughs> Look at you! You sure are getting the hang of these rolls. Let now me teach you one last trick. You can trick. preview your opponent's actions. I mean, that is to say, you can read their intent. Check it out. So here's where you can see all your opponent's intentions for this round. All your opponent's intended actions for the round will be listed here in order. Them. Reference this to come up with effective countermeasures and easily defeat your opponents. But they can see us as well. well then, that's the end of the tutorial. The end of the to Oh, I'm playing by myself now? Do I have a sword? The character deals one damage. I want to equip the sword. Ah! Oh, he doesn't use a sword. Ha! But he uses that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. Whatever. Ooh! Yeah, let's go, let's go. Oh, I'm scared. I want to see what Paymon does. Convert elemental death spent to Omni. Elemental death spent. Ah, okay. When character uses a skill or equips a talent. Spend one less peril die. Bruh. I could have used this before. And this is cryo die. Ah, uh, I'm so stupid. I should have read this before. Now it doesn't matter anyway. Yeah. Let's go. Let's just go. My opponent's turn. Yeah, it's the end. Roll dice, roll dice, roll dice, wait, roll wait, wait, dice. Wait, wait. <laughs> There's one more thing I almost forgot. Every what? time you hit an end phase, you get to draw two cards from your Ooh. pile. Remember, you have to make use of both your elemental dice and your action cards to win. Yeah, sure. Okay. Ooh, your opponent starts first. Roll face. Roll face. Roll face. Roll face. Uh, select dice to re-roll. Let's see how it goes. Okay, it's cryo all the time. Yeah, sure. I can... Uh... Switch. This will be interesting. Oh, it's my opening turn. End of the round? <laughs> okay. So, let me put this. Yes. Yes. Let me put this. No. I have to use two. Two elements. Sure. Okay. Now. I will... Is pow. Cool it. Cool it. Oh. Woo! I did it! Of course I did it. This is a tutorial. <laughs> she might challenge me to do a TCG. Oh, hell yeah. So as the decks construct their characters, so to tell various opponents, roll by eight dice or... Is this the same thing? All right. Cool. 
Well, we just played Genius Invocation TC, but the rule... Although I feel there is... That was quite the detail. <gasps> Ooh! I didn't know the Cat's Tales famous mixologist had such an eclectic skill Hello, set. Hello, Dillard. What? What? Oh, when did you get here? I stepped in while you were in the middle of your explanation. I hope I didn't dampen the mood. No, not at all. Anyway, what are you doing here? The cat's tail is a player in Mondstadt's alcohol industry. Naturally, you have some collaboration with my winery. I'm here today to discuss a few items of business with Margaret. Hmm, too bad she just left. But if you head off right now, you might still catch up with her. Never mind. It's too bad she left. Urgent. In fact, I think I'm now more interested in this card that you're using to teach them you the game. You are, Diluc? You want to Wait, play with me? This card? It's Diluc's character card! Hmm. Although I have some degree of experience with Genius Invocation TCG, seeing this particular card is a first for me. Liking what you see? Uh, a customer left it behind a few days ago, but he wasn't even playing the game while he was here. Oh? Uh, he wasn't wearing an eye patch, okay? He had a light complexion and a super serious look on his face. <laughs> he, he wasn't, wasn't wearing an eye patch. And looked like he was just drinking his worries away. He never seen him around here before. He wasn't wearing an eye patch, okay? Kaya, uh, um, aren't mm. they brothers? Eye patch, you say? <sighs> I was trying to give the opposite description, but I just ended up giving it away. Sorry, Gord Cabron. Don't worry. Somehow, I don't think he'll be giving you any trouble. Over Kaya it. had a Diluc card. So, what about the Diluc character card? I don't mind. It's just a card with my image on it. Mm-hmm. I didn't expect Diluc to be familiar with Genius Invocation TCG. The game has been catching on lately. Step brothers? Oh, then it's fine. It mentioned. <laughs> Every now and then, I'll <laughs> sit down and play a game with the customers in Angel Share. You up for a I game was now? I was hoping we could play a game. But this I issue of some... It's getting late. And someone has some explaining. Good. Sure. Bye. He doesn't want to play you with me. The door. Uh oh. Guard captain. Guard captain. I hope Kaya will be all right. Well, now that we are familiar with the rules, why don't we try playing a game of Genius and Vacation TCG? Okay. Ooh, two new players having their first ever duel. <laughs> <laughs> but okay. In order to play an official duel, three character remember, cards. A complete deck has to have three character cards and thirty action cards. Got it? Got it. Then let's use my cards. These were mixed in with all the others I had received. Can I about to have an eye patch on both eyes? I can see that this one must be the Sucrose character card. Sucrose now, character card. It looks like we each have the Kaya D Luke. Alright. Yep. We both have the same cards. Oh look at Sucrose! <gasps> oh, yes! No, I don't want to switch! She's beautiful! Next time you use a skill, when the switch to your next character in to be active character. Next time you use a skill. Who is she? She looks like Traveler, but with long hair and beautiful. Draw two cards. Omni. When you perform switch character. Huh? Convenient. Convert. No mental dice spent. So, um, here's a pyro. Polyarm. Yeah, yeah, I can switch this one. I don't have this one. When you perform a switch character, spend. Spend one less elemental dice once per round. I mean, but I use one to. No, it's not worth it to switch. I got a sword! In a dendro stuff. In a duel, your opponent can also use action cards, and they'll also be able to grab new cards during an end phase. At the same time, your opponent must also spend elemental dice to take actions, so you'll be unable to view their intent. 
Cool. I'm ready. Active character? Sword. Let's use Kaya. This will be interesting. I attack force. Roll dice. Kaya, 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 Kaya. Damn. No, but I don't want to roll the but I can't do anything anyways. Yeah, whatever. Cryo! Ah, good enough. My turn. Okay, I have to use two. Let's use this two. To the same element. Okay. This. Uh, what is this? Draw two cards. This only spends one. Yes. <laughs> Amber? Choose one summon on your side and grant it. Huh? Another Paymon? When action phase. I spent three? Nah, man, I can't do that. I don't know what she does. Oh! Yes, turning to Cryo. Oh, Amber is cool. Ooh. But I have to fight them all. I'm scared. <laughs> I will lose. I can't do insufficient elemental dice. Oh. Well, I can do anything then. So what I can do. Switch to your next. An action. Greatest. I can't do anything. <laughs> Ooh! Let's go, okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Cryo, give me cryo all the time. I might have to change. Yeah, I don't have cryo. I have four? What is this about? Next time you switch to your next character to be the active one. Choose one summon on the opposite side and destroy it. Huh? Oh, I can turn them into cryo. I can turn them all into cryo. No, okay, 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 okay. Um, before this round ends, the charger character costs one less. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, sure. Let's go. Let's go. I I can. Select the die to transform. Yeah, sure. Let's go. <laughs> oh, I could do elemental reactions. Ooh. She spends less cryo. Oh, she's equipping a sword in, in Kaya. Oh, I'm I'm I can't eat more. Let's finish this swiftly. Normal attack. Ouch. It's my turn. Yes. Oh. Oh, but Kaya could do the powerful attacks. I'm s I'm so stupid. I'm so stupid. He can already do the <gasps> Ito. <laughs> oh, <clears throat> bro.
sad. One play one only playable if one of these characters is defeated this wrong this <laughs> Yeah I can put this on her oops <clears throat> convert this two Okay Let's go. You took hard is a good question mark. I'm ending my round. She's running her round. Ha! My turn continues. Well, I have nothing else to do then. Ooh. Diluc is powerful. No. No. My opponent attacks first? Bro, no. Okay, I have cryo. Nice. Ready when you Okay. One character card defeated. Shut up. Just summon choose one summon on the opposite side and destroy it. No valid targets. When you perform switch characters spend one less. Ha! Uh, now! Ha ha! Brr. I spend nothing on changing like this, right? <laughs> Full cryo. Okay. I'm not done. <laughs> Darn. I didn't factor that into the Ooh. equation. End of their round, bruh. Oh no, it's just I want to use this, but it's not worth it. That's your switch character. Yeah, it's it's not worth it. She's going to die anyways. But I want to use it anyways. Don't Whatever. Oh, but I could use what next. I'm so dumb. I could use the next. I'm that. so dumb. No. I I could use next. Oh, no, I have three, huh? I'm so lost. What is this three? Ooh, mana, 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 round five. Uh. Yeah, I'm gonna to roll these bruh not better can't tell you that normal attack pow so your current active character gains one energy so next time you switch spend one less creates two omni two omni Oh, but th you don't spend anything on this. Okay. I'll switch this. 
and all. Yeah. Three of the same element? Bruh. Yeah, payment. Shut up. Um. Yeah, sure. Freeze. Freeze. Opponent's turn. They ended their round? Why did they end their round? Free. <laughs> what is this? It has to be two of the same elements, right? No, but I can't do anything. No. And round. Kai is bloodthirsty. Well, he can do this again. Opponents. Why is my opponents always starting first? That's not fair. Yeah, I, I will end him next, so it's fine. Ouch. Heal your active character? B bro, <laughs> yes. No. I can't do it. Eh, whatever. He's going to die anyway. Don't get frostbite. Dead. Where did I go wrong? Kaya always kills Daluk. Cool. Oh, this was so cool. I can't believe I lost. lost when we had the exact same character cards. The rules must be more complicated than I first thought. It's fine. Every decision is a difficult trade-off in this game. That's not how the rules work, Super. <clears throat> oh, I am sorry, but it was a fun match. Yep, you went easy on me. I didn't know you could get so competitive, Sucrose. Mm hmm. Moral of the story, Kaya always kills the look. Yep. I always get a little upset when I lose. <laughs> me too, Sucrose. Don't worry. It's like that with my research, too. It always gets to me when my experiments don't go as planned. Especially when there's an alchemy genius like Albedo around to compare myself to. Oh. Uh, you lost me at alchemy and experiment. Playing cards. Yep. <laughs> but a losing. Hmm. Besides, Sucrose, you're already missing. I agree. Good. Have not Oh, definitely. All right. I think you should. Bye. Burning months. How do I get cards? Just by playing? Come and try invocation. Come and try. I get 60. I see. Wishes. So you have now grasped the rule. Yep. <laughs> That's right. The tr uh, Da, da, da. Sobering words from Prince there. I want to play, dude. That means it's a crows more times than I'll be doing to crows. Recognized by the genius invocation TCG society. More times than I'll be doing to crows. I'll be doing better. I swear, Diluc is always be stabbed in the back by the brother. <laughs> We're still kind of in the tutorial. Okay. What does it? I don't yes, know. Yes, although basically. To become Go an official, official and not so three opponents. You have the duel you yep. I agree. Although I didn't get Same way. So let's trained sucrose. Let's play. Oh yes, my goodness. Completely slipped my mind. Everyone. I'm lucky to have Prince here to remind me. Free casket of tombs! Tamez mentioned it, didn't he? Light novels, we we're reading main oh, character found in attic, so anxious trapped inside. Of... <sighs> well are called cassettes. Hi, man, can guess what you're gonna say next? The, the re reason they can sense each other is because they have the souls of ancient TCG players inside. That would mean an extraordinarily high number of people in history no. have been turned into discs. Darn! What a With its own mechanism creates a cool to see first. 
Yeah, let's go. Okay. I just so want to play. Excellent plan. Let me play. Thank you. Go to Margaret. <laughs> uh, Margaret is the car. No. Ah, you are so kind. Okay. Now, where's Margaret? Ooh, here she is. Hello. Hello, you three. Hello. Has little Diona finished teaching you the rules of she genius? She did. Ah, I see you're here for your casket of tomes, aren't you? Yep. Ooh. So this is a, that's right. A purpose-built case for your card deck. That can Aww. even detect when someone else nearby is carrying one. Gosh, whoever invented this must have seriously disliked being alone. Yes. Yeah, well, even the most fun game is pretty long. True. So I'm glad that these customers, um, <coughs> TCG players, are able to congregate at the cat's tail. Uh -huh. You're not wrong, but that's... All right. In that case, thanks. Trust in your cards. Oh, you can edit your decks. Is it if I open you will challenge simply open your deck before selecting an edit just searching your location at sound the tab will appear along its mark oh find the player use the cars okay 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 let's go let's go so i can my deck you need to select a deck Deck three valid characters at the add select card review. Yeah, I can't do anything. Yeah, but it's fine. Oh yeah, search for players. That's right. Oh no, Swan. That's a player. Uno ito here in the flesh. <laughs> Da, da, da. There's a player nearby. That way. Let's go see. Bro, you. You should be working. <laughs> it's you. I'm sorry. Is there anything I can assist the two of you with? He's all talk and less gameplay. There's dialogues are, where dialogues are two phases. We want to become official genius invocation TCG players. Oh, I see. Oh, duty. But it's time to do 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 Kill or heal the target character 1 HP. Next time you'll switch to your next. The character deals. The bow. Bow? I don't have a bow. Okay. And I don't have dendro. I like this one. The car. Ah, yeah, sure. Select active character. Um, ready when you are. Ready when you are, says him. Okay, roll face. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Cryo, cryo. Cryo, cryo. I can deal with this. So. Okay. Uh Oh. Yeah. This one makes it cost less, right? Okay, so. Yep. Let's go. I killed the first one instantly. 
Well, I'm a good swan, but he's using monsters. Dodge this. That's that's not even how how this is like. He shouldn't play well. Oh well, yeah, he shouldn't. Heal the target character. Heal the target character. Okay. And round. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Mm -mm -mm. What is happening here? Klee and Albedo? Bro! Next time. Shift one uh, energy from at most two characters nearby active. Select character who will eat this food. He will eat this food now. Heal your active character for 2 HP. There's no need. I can kill him now. But let me change. Yes. I'll change you. No! Oops. Well. It's fine. <laughs> two, only two? Bruh. Sure. Freeze. You joined Discord? Hooray! Nice! Achieve victory. You can say screw all stuff on Discord if you don't want to do that. Will th the three great heroes with visions fit the heal across? <laughs> no, Vimora, definitely. I clicked to play again. I clicked to play again. I don't want to play again. Ameno? I draw. I cannot play again. Then what am I doing? Oh, let's I use the crows. I can do it. Haven't used her still. Ameno. Settings button. There's a settings button. Holy! Yeah, I'm against one. Okay. Like a carrot. Once per round. Choose one summon, destroy it. Your current character gains one energy. I can tr I can trade? Huh? Absorption test. I'm lost. Food. No. Yes. I don't understand what the symbol is here for. Since I can't do anything. It said my turn, and then it said eh, it's not my turn. I'm ending my round.
and phase. Bruh. I attack first. Roll. Scroll skills has an additional effect of swapping enemies out. Oh, okay. Bro, I don't have any. Huh. I can do this. <laughs> Lumao. Oh, it was because of the card I played. That makes total sense. I need three. I can definitely do that. Honestly. Why is the elemental deals one large wind spirit? Ooh. Deals two amino damage users three. Animal hypostasis emulation. You get to summon? Mm. And he attacks as well? But I can't use it. I'm so lost. Oh! Oh! Yeah, I clicked on try again. Whoops. Ooh. Okay. I'm Gosh, liking this. I lost. Yes, he again. lost. Ideally, not that when I'm in Dewey. Who Prince is going? He attacks during the end phase. Ah, that makes sense. Prince, where's the end? Defeat, Defeat the opponent. The opponent. I, not just Prince. I can't wait. Your opponent is on the waiting. Right, Naturally. When I heard the tidings of your sworn oath, I you know this voice. Forth, oh brave challenger. Pardon my directness, but we have not been waiting that long. Main Fräulein could afford to be a little less impatient. Huh? Hi, your opponent sounds that's what Prince said. I know this voices. I know this voices. Exactly, it's special. Who yes. But the princess in, for as the name of this hallowed rite suggests, it remembers a lot of official. The for I. Can the master of Some. cards hope to be crowned? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me win. One. It must be tread with great caution, for eternal doom and damnation are but one wrong step away at any given moment. Uh huh. That is why none is more suited to appear in this audience chamber than the princessin, whose alg de Ertelong des Grossen Kaleido Phantasmus has witnessed ten thousand battles across three thousand worlds. What is wrong with you, Fisher? Oh, is that right? Indeed, Main Fräulein has watched many games of Genius Fräulein. Invocation TCG. Oh, that's true. A duel ah, between beginners. Let's go, 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 let's go. Let's go, let's go. So a Indeed. <gasps> the princess in herself heeds the call of fate. Main Fräulein, I implore you to consider less odious terms of phrase. What? What say you, Outlander? Do you wish to... <sighs> <sighs> Best girl after Yaimiya? It's time to duel, let's go. Fischl, Bennett, and Kaya? <laughs> Of course, she has a card of herself. Why don't I have a card of myself? Oh, so I have Cryo and Hydro and Amino. 
choose one summon of your side and grant you one more uses from switch character spend one less episode <laughs> from Abby oh I ah! can do it I didn't want to choose her whoops Cryo, 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 cryo. Yeah, I, I can I can deal with this. So, first of all, yes. Second of all, and face healer active character. Shift one energy for the two. No, let's use this one. Yeah. A bow? Ouch! Oh, she's going to be a, a, bit, a, a little bit more of a challenge. Well, can't do anything more. Ooh. I'm watching the stream on my TV and my kids are distracted following your cursor. Oh, you're watching the stream on the TV? Damn, I'm on the TV? I must be really big right now. Ooh. You have a car. <laughs> Look at Paymon. Whatever. Okay. Freeze. Ouch. Huh? When action phase begins, creates two. I, I'm having a lot of summons and I'm loving it. I can't do any more thing. I, I can't do anything. Oh no, what's going to happen now? To heal. Ooh, oh man, this is so cool. I thought I was doomed. And now I know it. <laughs> oh. Holy. Oh, because of Paimon. Holy shit. Shift one. Shift one card has that has been applied to one of your characters to another one to the character the same type of weapon. You ha do me nothing. Next time you perform. Yeah, whatever. Um Let's go. Absorption test. My turn, the end of the round. But if it's her ability to change, how do I make it work? How do I make it work? If it's my 
if I have an ability that I can change... I just click, but I'm clicking. How do I do it? Someone help. If they're saying if you hit Bennett, it will switch to official. Okay. Stand clear. Open and switch. Ah! Ooh. Okay. Now I understand. We already have summons on the field. Create one will refetch their usage. Yes. Stand clear. That is why it's they are changing. Oh, this is really cool then. Oh, I'm a master at this right now. I'm a master. And Paymon is still here. Hey, look at me. Oh, I'm seeing so much potential for Amino. Okay. Oh. Normal attack out. Oh, let's see what these cards do. Uh, shift one, the same thing. I don't need that. Nope. Next time we switch, character will be considered a fast action instead of a combat action. Sure. Um, yes, sir. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. This is but a small sacrifice necessary to achieve ultimate victory. Uh huh, look at yourself, bro. They declare an end of their round. Absorption test. My turn continues. And you know what? Is she going to die now? BAM! Orange. BAM! Descent once again. Uh, what happened? Oz! With lightning, twitch the upper and lower mandible. Strike thy pointy beak into this obstacle and remove it from my path. Main Fräulein, I cannot simply attack the traveler. <laughs> Let's go! Ameno ta 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 Ameno do re ta 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 Ameno do ri me Destroy all summons? If you and your opponents? Ouch! Adjustments. Let's go. <laughs> now see what happens to those who dare defy the princessin! Uh huh, the princess and sure. Target attacks now. I could use it on him because he has that thing there, but I'm stupid. <laughs> end of their round it's fine it will be the end of their life bam the curse. bam victory shush let's go let's go this is definitely not a tutorial impossible oh, 
The cursed dragon looms near once more, casting its dark shadow on the slender throat. Nice. Of fate, <laughs> hiding him from my vision. Traveler. What a truly ingenious plot, and what an exciting duel to witness. Uh -huh. Congratulations. You've won three duels now. That makes you an official TCG player. I'm an official TCG player! Oh, yep. It's across your back. I've won two games so far. When I got back, I heard you were in the middle of your final duel. So I came over to watch. Aww. Hey, Super's won two as well! Great work! Hmm. It seems I am forced to admit, <laughs> fellow voyager of the stellar void, that you're... Mastery of the cards is second to none. <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? I mean, Fräulein wished. Wow, it's yeah. so <gasps> She gave me her character a card? Token of such. To the victor of this splendid duel is a boon of commensurate splendor due. Oh, um, excuse me, ma'am. I am also oh. a beginner who is Rachel denies your life. win in progress. You shall not be a TC player. Oh, never mind. She admits you're actually good. <laughs> nothing would delight me more. Okay. When I got back, Prince and Shuyun said there was something they needed to give you. If you managed to become an official. Hopefully TC an player. instant victory yeah, card. Card, in the world has a card like that. <laughs> I love bets it's some kind of prize for making it as an official TCG player. Let's I hope. Up. I hope. I want a prize. With three electro dice, I summon my eternal familiar. I want a prize. I love prizes. Talk to So Yo. So Yo. Ah, so it was you who won the duel in the end. Yeah, very, very well, well done. Official the first, first thing, thing. All new official TCG handbook. This handbook tells you exactly what you need to do to become a top tier TCG player. Make sure you read it. Sure. Secondly, a range of genius invocation merchandise is now available for you to purchase here at the Cat's Tale. <laughs> so you see, becoming an official TCG player is really just the first step. Woo! And thirdly, thirdly whenever wish you a wish game with a, game a friend, friend, use an invitation use, yes, aboard. It's right by the bar counter. Once you get the hang of it, you can play with your friends whenever you want. <laughs> it looks so cute. That's it, really. If there's anything else you didn't quite understand, what a you meme. can always come and ask me. <laughs> yes, indeed. I'm quite sure they will. Hope you have fun playing Genius Invocation TCG. Yep. Completed! Oh, a cat! A cat! I know he's a cat as well, but a cat is just walking towards me. Find a player open world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't worry. Oh, he's looking towards me. Okay. Didn't work. I just want to come, like, here. Didn't I receive something? I wanted to open... Oh, it's here. Invite character. Oh! Huh? Huh? Achieve victory? First time invitation required. Oh, I don't have that. Oh, this is really cool. I'm not going to do it now, but like... It's really cool. Travel you walking around with arms full of handbooks on top of all stolen books. Shh. Don't say anything. Oh, it has more TCG. Pl <gasps> She's a TCG player? <laughs> oh, bro. You know what we are going to do now? Let me look at the time. Hmm. Tarus. Where did Spirito descend? We will be reunited. Oh, you guys were talking about this one, right? You didn't return the books to Lysa? Shh, 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 shh. I am not sure which of which of them they wanted me to do. Oh, this story quest, right? He wants Tauros Iracons chapter one to something. I don't
don't even have that. Ambrosia Imperatix Ambrosia. Another one that I have no clue what it is about. Jade Chamber. We have one payment left. Is it prepared to leave? Come across information paddlers. Arkant quest, story quest, commission quest, and world quests. Why is this one like with something? Supposed to the special commission. A commission for f fishing associ fishing association, fishing association, fishing association. Need help? Yes. Good day. A senior fish. A lot of fish appeared. Some people must say recent investigation, something with the environment. Too many fish. Payman will take care of it. No trouble. The more fish, the better fast fishing. To be honest, manpower available. Flip side, I thought this is a great opportunity to grow. I put a commission in the adventure guild? Yes, I want to join. I want to join Cedar Lake, Cedar Lake, Cedar Lake. Fish grounds, I prepared newcomers. I'll teach you the basics. <gasps> he will teach me the basics? Where is Cedar Lake? Oh, it's there. Ooh. Have to do it before the Arkham Quest? Yeah, I think I have to do a lot of things before the Arkham Quest. Like, I, the game doesn't even let me proceed. So now I can just, like, hit trees. Hello, Skya. <laughs> Can't catch me. So, getting wood is actually not hard. You just have like to hit trees. Oh. Okay. Oh, I already did this one. Traumatic fish memories. See those little fish in the water to save the souls, fishing rods, bait, formulas for making baits. Bait on the hook. Aim for the fish, catch your rod. Beginner's luck. <laughs> yeah, I catch it. Paymon. <laughs> what kind of fish? It's a sort of wondrous seafood that I managed to cut last time. When did Paymon go from emergency food to wondrous seafood? Didn't realize you were actually inexperienced. Fishing! Fishing! You should see the ripples. I mean the fishing spots. Fish are sensitive. They will... Different water, different species. While preparing the fish, you can feel the specialities. Appropriation rod and bait. Blueprints. Hold the cast rod button to enter in enemy mode. Then let go to fish and hook out. If your hook lands too far from the fish, its ability its ability to attract them will greatly decrease. Oh, okay. If the lands too close by, the fish will be sorted and flee the scene. When the fish are on the hook, click Click the raise hook button or the fish might 
Finish hitting your bait and flee. Ooh. When the fish enters a struggling state, you can hold and release the fish button to adjust your fishing line tension and keep it in the yellow ideal tension zone. Fishing progress will increase if you stay in the ideal tension zone. Fish uh, on the hook will sometimes enter periods of intense struggle. The speed at which line tension may change will be affected. Okay. Orange starts fluctuating highly. Ooh. The fish will try to escape the tension. Turns red. Ooh, Don't the Sims. Underestimate the beetle. They can be some tough oh, there's a fishing spot. Yeah, I want to fish. How do I fish? Fishing? <gasps> Oops. <laughs> yeah, you nearly got him. Ah! That was a tough fight. That wasn't a tough one. Learn the formula. I got my first fish, right? No, no, I want to fish again. Let me fish. It has a bigger fish. So close, so close. Stay cool. Wow, Paimon's stomach is rumbling already. She's so beautiful. Mm. He doesn't want it. Do I have the wrong bait? Do I have any bait at all? Or do I just need more patience? Need to use a different bait. Okay. Okay. Yee! How did it go? Yes! Ordinary little fish in the park. I should consider give you something more challenge. Different from the same species can have huge difference between individual different environments of food. They look the same. Some individual blah, blah, blah. And superior, best commercial, hobbling prices, ornamental fish. There's ornamental paimon. <laughs> 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 Looks like you got it already. Have been ornamental fish active in water of storm barren mountains. I marked in your map. Okay. There are certainly lively and more valuable specimens of each fish species on our ornamental fish and fishing points will but such fish will be more obvious ripples effects. Okay. Ornamental fish will be raised in a pool of sapphire with serenity pots. Ooh. Go to somewhere in the mountains. Yeah, okay. Can't catch me. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. <gasps> Fishing. Like Sarte Valley. Ah, you've got it. You got it. Uh, I thinks you've earned yourself a new title. I got a fish. 
schon eine Fish Tank. You know what happened? No, let me show you. We found some beautiful fishing places when I was exploring the map and I marked it for cooking instead of taking them to the water. Fishes for cooking. Paymon sushi, yes. Can't catch me. Oh. Um, <clears throat> anyways, the fishing spot was there. Can't catch me. <laughs> Do I have to be down? Yeah, I must have to be down. It was Where was it? Yeah, here. See? It has beautiful fishes. That I tried to catch them, but I couldn't. <laughs> Maybe they don't like this bait. That one likes it. Victory is almost ours. Hey! Oh, that was a tough fight. Will they like this? <gasps> Oh, uh, they don't like this. Will they like this? Oh, <gasps> yes! I will get such a beautiful fish. So close, so close. Such a beautiful fish! What about this? Will they want this? Yes! I got a bite. <laughs> Victory is almost ours. Paymon, shut up. Ooh, <gasps> a, tough fight. a beautiful, beautiful fish. And uh, I found other place as well. Was it here? No. Uh, where was it? I found the other place. And I pointed it on my map, I think. I oh here 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 see let's go there let's catch the fish there amazing fish let's eat them bro no oh there was like an geocally on top of a house like a windmill can't catch me yeah it's there it had some cute things as well ah! oops hmm <laughs> no <laughs> you're too big ah fish presents He likes it. No, he doesn't. Hmm. What about this bait? No one's interested. Hmm. What about this one? Someone has to be interested in this bait. Right? Right? <laughs> nope. Uh, what about this one? Oh, okay. Come over. Uh, 
<laughs> the fish animation. Holy! Uh, no. <clears throat> Fish is bigger than Paimon can replace her. Yes, indeed, you're right. So let's talk to the guy. He, we got so many fishes. If only convince Paimon. If you turn down the general volume, or voice volume. It's a big to get on and stuff. <laughs> Oh, I didn't know this door was here. No, I did. It, it happened something with the helicals here, right? And the look appeared. He was uh, something in the night. Can't catch me. Hello, hello. Back to soon. Yes, definitely uh, something. Hurry up and do more commissions. Attract the talents. Train the fishing. Find goods. Ooh, oh, oh, such a beautiful. You can change codfish or association very visions. You can also use them to meet in cooking. No, stop. Oh, I can I can buy on him. I like to buy fish supplies. Oh, formulas. Oh, I don't I have to catch a lot of this. Insufficient materials? What do you want? Ooh, I need a lot of fishes. A lot of fishes. A lot of fishes. A lot of so I need these fishes. I need these fishes. I need three, six, nine, twelve. Yeah, where was the fishing spots? He said the fishing spots on the mountains here. Let's go. You can get a secret achievement if you repeatedly turn down and on the voice volume. Lumo. Can't catch me. Ah Exactly. Okay. We'll get these fishes, all of them. Wait. Nine. Nine. So. Damn, he became crazy, bro. It was too close of him. <laughs> Probably. Yeah. But I'm too far away now. <laughs> Come here! Yes. You've got it! You got it! Yep. Ooh, that was a tough fight. Aww. But now what? Now it doesn't have more. Mm. Did the other places have those fishes? I'm not sure. I think they didn't. Well, this one I don't remember seeing them. But on this one, perhaps. Fashax when we play with that high and fish game. Bro, I swear, yes. Them. At least someone saw the video. How the Arkham quests are going? I can't do the Arkham quests. Because. Oh, but it doesn't appear here. Well, then I can't do anything. Greg the fish is with us. <laughs> Greg. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, I don't miss Greg. Like, I can't um, do the Arkham quests because 
Look. Uh, they are blocked because I have to do other missions too first. <laughs> Could show you some more fishing spots. Yeah, not now, but yeah. Greg mutated by now, bro, I swear. On that place that he left. Poor Timmy. Shh. Timmy wasn't here. He's sleeping. So, false worm blade, fake fly bait, fishing line stabilizer? What is this? Can you install and facilitate fish facilitate fishing? The threat and record how hard? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. When you obtain the various fishing around sub laser. Okay, next things. What else can I do? Um I can do this thing here. I'm not sure what else do I have to do here to continue. Complete we will be reunited. Complete both keepers and sleeth. Okay. I saw that one. It's here. Okay. Let's do that one then. It's you, the guy? As Clarence? Oh, you're Lawrence. Ah, honorary knight. Is something the matter? Looking at a stranger, uh, with, stranger an eye with an patch. eye patch. Hmm. Let me think. He Blonde. was wandering all over Mondstadt at first, which I found rather suspicious. So I decided to keep an eye on him for a while. Uh, I lost him pretty quickly. Still, as long as Master Jean is here, there's nothing to fear from some suspicious, unusual-looking person. Then might be true. But if it were up to Jean, she'd take this way more seriously. True. <laughs> that is true. But on the other hand... Overreact. That, uh, anyways. Oh, yeah. He was at Wagner Smithy for a while before I tried telling him. He might have said something to Wagner. You should go ask him. Okay, Maybe. let's go to Wagner. Who is he? Oh. You're Wagner. Okay. Why? You need something? Looking at a stranger uh, with an eye patch. I remember him. He showed up a few days ago asking to buy a bunch of forging materials. You look nice. Can't say I've heard of any of the materials he mentioned, though. He then had a look at the weapons in my shop before leaving. I've heard that he can be found drinking at the Angel's Share. If Angel's the Share. Guild want to get hold of him. The Angel's Share. Angel's Share. Angel's Share. I don't remember the thing about the yours. Adventure challenge? Bro, he plays CCG? Bidding him would be the best thing ever. Take your pick. The better Kaya? As the description says? Huh? Oh, because of the eye patch? <laughs> CCG? It's not CCG. It's TCG. TCG. TCG! Portuguese for you! TCG! That's how we call it in Portuguese. TCG. So, whatever. <laughs> I'll call it TCG from now on. Can you have different value? Charles. What will it be? 
Grape juice or apple cider? Another day, another lack of alcoholic hey, options. Have you seen a blonde stranger who wears an eye patch around here by any chance? That I have. He comes here every night. Just <laughs> Doesn't order anything else. It's not Kaya. He even sometimes mixes his own drinks after he orders them. I hope the stranger with the eye patch isn't gonna betray us like Kaya. Everyone does. Kamisa Toyata, don't get your hopes high. I don't know Everyone anything does. else about him, but from his selections and mixes, I'd say that he's quite the connoisseur. And what's Master D. Luke's opinion? Why, I just gave it to you. Quite the connoisseur. Investigating everything as always. Guess that's D. Bartender D. Zongli? If you're looking for that gentleman, he ordered oh, some because of the voice of actor. in advance yesterday. So he should be here today, too. Maybe. There's too many raucous patrons on the first floor, so if you want to wait. The first floor. Go to the second floor. Second floor. Wait on the seat. By the railing. This isn't the seat. What's the seat by the... Oh, man. I'm... No, this is the first floor, right? Can I... But I can't come here. Oh, Lord. Is this a door? <gasps> Leave Tavern? Songly voices so many characters. For real? Lower five meters. He said to come in the, the, the floor. Oh no! This is the, that mission that I never did. Yep. No! But this isn't the, the, the thing that I'm doing. No, I don't care about the thief catcher. I want this. Go to the second floor and turn by the s on the seat by the railing. What is a railing? Next to the railing? I don't know what a railing is. <laughs> it's a table that's next to the railing at the top. What's a railing? What's <laughs> a railing? Is, is this a railing? <laughs> Balcony? Is this? Is this? Is the thing that prevents you? Oh, okay. Ah. <laughs> uh, ah welcome, okay. Sir. The Thank wine you. That you previously ordered <laughs> is here. <laughs> He's really here? Let's go downstairs and have a look. <laughs> Imagine he had to wait for us a few years by him. Yeah, and then it's Kaya. Kai is here. Go to the first floor. Find the stranger. Oh! It's really here! A blonde with an eye patch. Adventure of an Adventure Guild. How do you do? Wow. Honorary Knights of Favonius. No huh? So, I'm a, a traveler. traveler. You say? Why are you traveling? I'm looking for my lost relative. <sighs> well, that's as good a reason as any. Sit down over there then. So, Ooh, we broke his, uh, what a weird guy. his eye patch kind of has a hole. <laughs> 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 hmm. That little one beside you. Emergency that's food. Not true. And you know it. Nope. It's indeed a good thing to have someone accompany you on your travels. Mm. My name's Dainsliff. I suppose you have some business with me? Hope we invite you to adventure sure. with us. Sure? Huh? He was so cold just a moment before. Hyman's got a bad feeling about this. But I will require advance payment. Advance payment? How much? 500 mora. And three answered questions. Done. 
The 500 is a one-time fee, and we'll settle the questions in a moment. That's it? That's it. Oh, now Paimon's got a really bad feeling. That kind of compensation can't be right. Here's a 500 ah, more. Thank you. Now, as for my questions, I'd like you to answer them here and now. Do I need to answer them all correctly? The answer to a question says nothing about right and wrong. Only about differences in attitude. Oh. I only okay. wish to know what your choices are. You need only answer. Okay. Question one. The crisis Mondstadt faced was resolved by an alliance between yourself and that... Animo Archon who calls himself Venti. Who, in your view, was the key to ending that crisis? How did you know where Venti I know is? everything that I should. Okay. <laughs> well, answer the question. Unity of Mondstadt favor? No. Who was it? It was me. Is that your answer? Hmm. I see. Venti didn't do anything. Question number two. Rex Lapis, who has defended Liyue Harbor for millennia on end, used his Gnosis to lay down a contract to end all contracts, of which the stipulations are still unknown. How do you know that? Who do you think will defend Liyue Harbor in the future, now that they've lost their deity? That's Liyue Kitchen. So that's your answer? I see. Oh... Zongli and Danfli, Zongli won 6 million more by child, Danfli 500. Now for my final question. This world has people who gained visions and those who did not. Which of the two do you think hold more importance in the eyes of the gods? Perhaps none of them do. So, this is your answer then. <laughs> I understand. It seems that you're different from him. He knows my brother! Right? <laughs> I'll take that 500 Mora. And now I also understand your views on this world. That said, I only take commissions related to the Abyss Order. Uh, now? Like you, I am currently on a journey. You intend to find your sibling, while I wish to oppose the Abyss. Ugh. Those creatures that serve the Abyss are the fangs and claws by which the Order spreads chaos in this world. I have come to Mondstadt this time while on the trail of an Abyss Herald. An Abyss Herald? Hmm. An even more twisted Abyssal being. One that commands the Abyss Mages. The only herald that I know, it's like from League of Legends. It's a kind of dragon that you... It's, it's a, a beast that you kill. And then summon on lanes to get rid of towers. <laughs> oh, that's right! We've just been fighting against the Fatui and Liyue, who are human too. We haven't encountered the non-human abyss order at all. There's some reason behind that, I'm afraid. It's possible that they may have been under orders to avoid your path. Ooh. Oh, that does sound pretty dangerous. <gasps> Maybe they're looking for a better time to ambush us or something. They won't defeat uh -huh. me. We're super duper strong. That manner. It's just like his. Well then, let's go see for ourselves, shall we? According to the leads I have on hand, the Abyss Order has re-infiltrated the Temple of the Falcon. Wait. The Dunslave... The Dunslave... ...mission comes before that we will be reunited. We saw our brother... ...that was possessed. I don't care, he was possessed. When... ...we killed... It didn't kill, but we destroyed the evil on uh, on monsters, all of that thing. I will see my brother. Let's meet up at the temple. Perhaps your questions about the abyss will he be answered. He knows my there. brother. 
They all know my brother. Who's this for? This abandoned temple does bear some marks of the abyss, the falcon of the west. Though it can soar in the wind, it ultimately does naught but hover under the light of the gods. Hmm? Oh, it's nothing. Let's head inside. Hmm. Recommend the parties. Cryo. Cryo. Cryo is recommended. If it's cryo, it should be like. What is good against cryo? No. What is cryo good against? Cryo is good against electro. They will have electro people. Oh! Wait. Pyro electros? Electro, cryo, blazing pyro. Pyro hydro? <laughs> Bruh. Okay, sure. Electro, pyro, cryo. The stage contains a pyro elemental node. It will apply a pyro buff to nearby opponents. Cryo for freezing hydro. So, you come with me. My mind is completely You blank. come with me. I need to get out and unwind. Wish me luck. And. They're suggesting you have cryo. Kill kill pyro shields. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. It's not far now. Paimon wonders what the abyss heroes look like. Do they look something like the Abyss Mages? Let's head further in first. If we do see that creature, that'll spare hmm. me the explanation right away. Well, neither an element, but I think it's for Pyro and Ice. Okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Don't be scared. Ready, steady, go. Let's go! Uh, there's a chest. Considering all enemies Abby has destroyed over herself, maybe nothing but an ant. Yep. Honestly. Agreed. Wolf hooks. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Not now. Pa 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 Here comes the fireworks! Feel the 
Oh wait! Ha. You're what? <laughs> You're Pyro? Let me um, present you something. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Nice elemental reactions. <laughs> Thank you. You know how much hate I got in the beginning because of me not doing the elemental reactions right? They were like, ah. So, your water. I'm sorry, but I need. Okay. Pa 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 pa. Okay, and you're the one that. Don't be scared. Woo! Melt, 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 melt. Let the show begin. He did. Talk to Denslid. Ooh. Just a few abyss mages. Seems like that herald might have already left. Could you tell me more the about abyss, the abyss order? It is chaos, and it is also destruction. It is a morass of inconceivable madness that encroaches upon this world's very foundations. That is why even the dragon of the east, a servant of a deity, was unable to resist its corrosive powers. And the creatures of the Abyss desire nothing less than the overthrow of a world ruled by the Archons. You seem to know a lot about the Abyss, Dane. <laughs> yep. Well, we do have some history. Yeah, he looks like someone who would be on the Abyss. I suppose that's as far as chit-chat goes. We should head to Wolvendom. Judging by the traces I'm following... Their next appearance may be within the territory of that old wolf. Perhaps old wolf? we may find our abyss herald there. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, I got a precious chest. Ooh, I got so cool things. <laughs> let's leave. Lila is an abyss mage kind that has similar animation and she's annoying because she freezes. <laughs> huh? Why did the fighting music start? Okay. Looking for apple, three apples. Three apples? Leanne's troubles. This was a a world quest. I just randomly did a world quest. <laughs> she wanted three apples. <laughs> Oh no, I hate coming here. Ugh. I never go on the right place. Ooh. Did 
Did I guard it? No. I didn't get it. Huh? I didn't get the chest. Damn. Funny. It's super annoying in wolf. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, a chest. Fuck. Speed of light. She's doing a lot more damage after I spend some time looking at the artifacts. Ah! Oops. Actually. I have like uh, I tried to level them up to f level 5, the ones that I think are important. I really want another Sundering Furry. <laughs> Two years seem coming more and more convenient well, teleports for the big toggle. Bro, I swear. Let's go. Lord of Wolvendom, great wolf king of the north. Yep. Sharp of fang and keen of claw. And yet dwelling here only. We're familiar with the no, wolf? Nor does it know me. I only know these things because a previous traveling companion of mine once wanted to hear its story. All right. Let's go see if that Abyss Herald has stopped by here. But where do we begin? Hmm. Are you standing here because of these strange bonfires, Dane? Indeed. See that? Floating above the flames? It's an abyssal spell. Huh. Knowing what I do of the Order's habits, they've probably left similar marks behind elsewhere. Let's have a look nearby. Okay. Five star artifacts. Beautiful five. Oh. Look for clues. Oh, okay. Yeah. There are a lot of beautiful artifacts that I still don't have. Well, that chest is normal to have something. Yeah, that's like a normal chest. Do you think that those monsters by the bonfire are under the Abyss Order's control? Looks yep. Kinda scary. Let's beat them up first. Pa 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 pa. Your fire? Hello. We can do it. Oops, I wanted to use Lila. Frozen, frozen, frozen. <laughs> Ouch. Don't blink. That's that. Let's go check out. Looks like this bonfire's also got something to do with the abyss. Well, I saw that already. Bruh. I'm grabbing a lot of wolf somethings. Ooh. Da -da -da. And there's another one of those bonfire spells. Looks like the abyss rejects. Where did these monsters pop out from? Let's clear them out and quit! Stars, shine for me. Speed of light. 
Damn. I'm liking to see them all explode. Didn't the other one fail? Where is he? Where is he? Okay, he's there. Same place, same time, same everything. Let's go. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Woo! Have you finished searching? Yep. I searched around these parts and found that they were left behind by abyss mages. It hmm. seems that even an abyss herald would not wish to make trouble with the wolf king of the north. We hmm. should leave as well. No. There One more place. On then. Storm Tower's lair. Why is always... Oh! They're looking for... the. We went... To a place... We went to like something falcon... And now the wolf. Now the dragon. Are you understanding? Weren't there four? They're going there. We are searching for all the like, I don't know, gods or protectors of this place. I've heard about what happened to you during Mondstadt's crisis, but I suppose that this place is more Lair than storm terror at this point. Four winds. Yeah. In fact, if my memory serves, this ruin has had largely nothing to do with that dragon for a long time. The hmm. first time I laid eyes upon the ruins of old Mondstadt, the dragon of the east had yet to fall, much less come to nest in this place. Huh? But Byron remembers that Devalin first got in trouble hundreds of years ago. How old are you? I don't think too much about it. Huh? <gasps> uh-huh. Do you remember the light actuators that once sealed this ruin? Why you have... He has a cape like Paimon's wings. If the Abyss Order is interested in this location, then they will not neglect those mechanisms. I mean, Let's you guys call this her wings. I don't see actuators. this has her wings. This comes from her neck. Like, doesn't make sense being her wings. It's just like her cape or something. Go deeper. Okay. Sus Paymon. Uh huh. Sussy, sussy. <laughs> Paymon and Densley are brothers? <laughs> there are lots of monsters gathered over there. Cryo, cryo. Oh no, you're fire. Pa 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 Oops I'm I don't know about you but I love them all together Oh lord. Ah! My guiding stars. Don't be scared. Sheet of light. Nowhere to hide. Boom. Not now. <laughs> I'm just making them stuck. them all the time, bro.
Okay. Now, her. They are just freezing, I love it. It's kind of a boring gameplay, but you know. If they are dying, I it's okay by me. Woo! Why do I have to do all the dirty work? Okay, so Queen West we Girl, yes. Find that abyss herald. Bummer. I Quite a shame. Not having to gaze upon such a creature a shame, exactly. Still, I do believe that you will come across one eventually. Mm, yep. No, you're right. If it's a really powerful monster, it would be best to go around it. Yep. <sighs> How good it would be if all perils one encounters in their journeys could simply be solved by going around them. You seem familiar with journeys. Time, yes. Yeah. I Traveler always has to do the dirty work. Uh, you know, Dane, you keep talking about that person this and that person <laughs> Shame. That? Shame that we haven't met a deadly creature yet. We have met deadly creatures yet. Where are they now? Anyway? Have darkness power? Looks like he it. No longer travels. I'm afraid that traveling can be too exhausting at times. He no longer travels. Oh, is that how it is? Well, why are you traveling alone then? I still have some things left unfinished. Once they are done, I too will return home to rest. Home. <sighs> yep, and it's good to have a home to come back to, isn't it? We camp out a lot when we travel. Hey, you guys will appear on my be real. Yeah, I, I installed be real, and I like it. I think it's better hey, than any other social media. Sibling, Although it doesn't have messages here, and stuff, we? I don't know. I find it fun see what people are doing in weird times mm. Mondstadt's fisherman's toast is pretty tasty but Liyue's one the either way settle down in a place she wants home. to well it home. won't be too late to think about where you stay once your journey reaches its end hmm. while you're still traveling you should what is going on says something huh? familiar what's familiar I felt it for a moment when a you familiar came here feeling too. you say it could be someone you know well could it be their base? whichever it is we should see it for ourselves and yes see clearly yes we can reach the top of that cliff from over there oh from over there oh, there Dan where moves really fast doesn't he Let's there where oh, okay to catch up. oh her brother oh man it does look like the way that she looked Oh man. Ooh. I'm here. Whoa. Yeah, look at look at the paws. Do you see the marks on the Can ground? You still sense that familiar feeling that you like, nearby. Feel like there's anything around here. Indeed. There doesn't seem to be anything strange about this place. It doesn't look any different from the last time I was here. Last time? My traveling companion brought Uh huh. Me? I merely no followed my traveling companion around on that journey. That's all there was to it. Sub zombie. Huh? Huh? The marks on the Ruined ground, see? Footprint. Ruin guard was wandering around here. No peace to be found, even for a single dandelion. Dandelion? You were 
I'm just spacing out. Huh? We could feel him. You mean your brother? But how could that be? You only touched that dandelion for a second. The moment hmm. I touched it. Perhaps that dandelion bears some sort of scent that only you recognize. As for why, has it perhaps experienced something related to you? Confusing stuff. Do not rush. Vexation and anxiety are the enemy of rational thought. Your journey has only just begun, has it not? At least you now know that he is still on this world. At this time, the most important thing is the journey to find him itself. Yes. And this is something you must keep in mind as the meaning behind your journey. May you find your kin at the end of that journey. Well then, let us part ways here for now. Huh? You're leaving? Already? Only for now. Don't worry. We will meet again. We will be reunited. After all, I did take 500 mora and those three answers you gave me. I don't have much time. But I have no idea what's going on. We pray this man and he's telling us a lot. We are finding things about our world. How come this game will have like, I don't know, 10 years or something of development? And we are already finding clues about our brother. We play our god a million and he revealed nothing. Oh, yes. We the seven dragons. God still. This time is different. Oh, this are the Valor. treasures. Huh? Ganyu, what are you doing here with Juan? Do you have a commission you need to post? Hello. What's your element, Cryo? We were just discussing the treasure hoarders. Coconut milk? Yes. Coco goat's milk? We were just saying how even the audacious treasure hoarder should know better than to mess with the abyss. Coco goes. It's just too evil. But we recently received intel from the Ministry of Civil Affairs that two big-time treasure hoarders in Liyue and Mondstadt are planning some big joint operation. Huh. Two big-time treasure hoarders? Yes. They're known as Big Sis of the South and Raptor of the North. Oh, Raptor! Paimon remembers he tried to run away from Amber and Mondstadt. But who's Big Sis of the South? She's a boss. You already know something then. I guess you must have crossed paths with the treasure hoarders many times before. Huh. You were correct. She's the head of the treasure hoarders in Liyue. As I understand it, the treasure hoarders all call her boss. Some say that the god of thieves even bestowed a gift upon her for her exploits, making her Big Sis of the Gods. But that's probably I just can. a wild rumor. Like, won't I be spoiled seeing the we will be reunited? I mean... Anyway, I don't know. I didn't see it, so I don't know what's in there. ...unexplored ruins that the Abyss Order has been secretly guarding in the shadows. Despite how dangerous that makes it, all the treasure hoarders can think about is what kinds of treasure could be inside. They have already devised a plan. They will send out a decoy to divert the Abyss Order's forces away from the ruins. Then, send an expert thief inside to steal the treasure. To this end, Big Sis and Raptor have reportedly recruited a certain Grand Thief from Fontaine. Grand Thief? That's quite an impressive sounding title. Oh, indeed. He is an extraordinary individual. The Grand Thief is highly respected in the Treasure Hoarders. In the same way that we adventurers look up to great adventurers. Uh, I don't know which one of them. Ah, you met the living legend himself while you were in Mondstadt. Correct. The Grand Thief is someone just as renowned as him. So, despite being relative big-timers in Liyue and Mondstadt, 
Big Sis and Raptor had to put in a lot of work to convince a thief of his status to come and personally oversee this operation. With the major changes in Leola recently, the Ministry of Civil Affairs and the Millilith already have their hands full. They don't have any time to investigate rumors about treasure hoarder activity. Hmm. But anything related to the Abyss makes me feel like there is some unknown danger lurking beneath the surface. So I decided to come to the Adventurer's Guild to post a commission. Let's understand the danger. Leave this commission to us! Oh, thank you so much. Good to see this in the hands of a reliable guild member. Well then, good luck. The guild will take care of the details of this commission. Damn. Go to the ruins? Well, at least I unlocked the tail- <gasps> So pretty. The ruined guard for me will connect. Oh man. Is there more fishes? Cryo. Oh. Hydro. Cryo. Abyss. Abyss Herald? Party is low. As tall as my big sister. I always do that. I spoil myself. I, I like. I didn't. <laughs> I didn't even know. Okay. I didn't even know that you could see the enemies you would fight with. You guys told me that. I wouldn't have found out if you guys didn't tell me that. And you guys did. So now, I can even level her up even more if I have Core Lapis. Mansuhulao? Oh, I want Core Lapis. I never bothered looking at the enemies. Core Lapis in the shop. But I think I bought them all which shop is there a, sh a shop like the shop shop no it's not on the shop shop it's on another shop lee shop oh man i bet i have already bought them all So many people wanting to talk to me. Holy, I'm not even prepared for this. I haven't done all of Mondstadt things. Well, not on the jewelry. <laughs> there must be other shops, right? I'm just blind. Toy shop, umbrella shop, the umbrella shop shop. <laughs> what is an umbrella shop shop? It's umbrella shop shop. <laughs> shop shop shop. The umbrella shop. The umbrella shop shop. Shop shop. <laughs> Mm. 
There's a street stall with a lot of umbrellas. Okay, so she's a toy seller. She has nothing. At the start. At the start. Where's the start? It's this start or the other starts? I have no idea. So, umbrellas. Well, this is a shop as well. Uh, okay, now this is food. Near the diamond shop. Okay, near the diamond shop. I'm not going anywhere, wait. My love. My love. Holy. I can't even level her up almost. It takes so much more to level up people. <laughs> I can't do anything about their marks. I don't care. Why not? I wonder when I'll be as tall as my big sister. The key here is consumer cycle. Yo, me and his neck of weed to level up. <laughs> the million, the question of millions. This sounds much better in Portuguese. A pergunta de milhões. I'm not addicted. You are. So she's even more level. Uh. Ha! Oops. There was something. It's also really easy to follow the monsters at the time. Yeah. There is something that I wanted. But it's not going to be for today. Okay, let's let's do this. Let's go. 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 Ah! <clears throat> Just such an horrible. Uh. Something. Yell. <laughs> Go, let's go. I don't even want to look. I don't even want to look. There's seven four one to allow one near Oceanid's waypoints. Oh, okay. Follow the treasure hoarders.
This looks there dark. There are signs of treasure hoarder activity here. They must have come to these ruins. Let's go deeper inside. Paimon sure hopes Ganyu's information is reliable. Is everything dark? There aren't many guards here. Looks like their plan to draw away the Abyss Order's forces really worked! Let's go. Okay. Next, 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 next. Store of resurrection. More signs that a treasure hoarder was here. This should be the right direction. But what is this? Why does it feel stranger and stranger as we make it deeper into these ruins? <laughs> you must um, not be able to... Be careful now! Paimon's right behind you! Ah! Okay, got it. is weird Ooh Such a weird place The P depression quest He dead. This looks like a person. He's Could dead. Be the grand thief? He's Why dead. In that position? <gasps> That's Why is the statue of the seven hanging upside down? And the statue's hands. Paimon remembers they're normally holding an orb, right? But this statue is holding... What is that? Uh... Paimon has a really bad feeling about this. And the Grand Thief hasn't moved an inch. Do... Do you think he's... Um... Hello? Are you... No, he's blinker? blinking. He's blinking. Run. What is going on? You are going on. You cannot spy on the secrets of the abyss. Pro Abby, yes. You have come here. You have seen our secrets. For this, you must pay the price. It's a Thirty minutes? What do you guys As mean? Was it lagging or something? Eat out your punishment. An abyss herald. Dane, 
Did he send you here to die? His resistance against the abyss has got the abyss. Is unstoppable. is unstoppable. I'm so sorry, but I'm going to kill you. What is it? Too bad. Ah! Freezing team, bro. It seems familiar. Seems familiar? I see. You are the so one? It's you. You are the one. The one? In that case, I shall stay here no longer. Avoiding me? He knows me. He's trying to protect me. What? No. He seems to know me. He knows my brother. He has orders to not mess with me because it's my brother and he doesn't want anything bad to happen to me. But... Huh? What is it? But if what he's possessed, he wouldn't do that. Oh, right. Yeah. We're near the is he now. conscious? Let's get out of this scary place. No. You know, the, s the same way that the dragon had like that spine and whatever that was there bothering her and changing her mi his mind, although he talked and something, it maybe has feelings. Bro, it must be the same thing about my brother. If you accidentally tap the next cell before you're ready to, ready, you have to kill yourself so and to actually finish it. For real? A little sooner than I had expected. Then. Judging by your expression, it seems you just could it yeah. be that you encounter huh? I did. I've been on the Abyss Herald's trail. I didn't expect to find you here as wasn't well. all we encountered. An inverted statue of the Seven holding, abyss holding power. abyssal power in its hands. Tell me the rest of what happened in there. So you escaped. And then, as we got close to the exit, we fought a big battle with that thing. Yes, this is a rare opportunity indeed. Yes, Let's sir. Go. A rare opportunity? With Dane helping out, maybe we'll be able to solve more mysteries about the abyss. Well, we will on the next episode. Not today. Let me just catch this Ikiko. <laughs> Man. Wow. We're doing a lot of things. And finding out more about my brother especially. Freeze an opener over 10 seconds? Yes. I will. Oh man, I can't wait to get all of these name cards. So many primal gens. Can I buy another wish? I can. <sighs> okay. Let's go. We are going to end this for today. Oh man. Well, the next. I I, I still gotta see the next thing that we are going to do though, but. I'm I'm really excited to pick up Beyond the Souls once more. Um, I have to do, uh, I have to see when I'm going to do that. Well, next Monday, it's always Mondays, right? Yeah, next Monday, I'll pick up Beyond the Souls. I won't stream this this weekend. I can't, but man, this was quite an adventure. And you're seeing like my characters are a lot stronger, and the elemental reactions, Lila and Barbara, they look pretty well. But like, 
I can't wait to have other uh, hydro characters, but until then, do we have any uh, other hydro characters? We don't. We don't. We have one. We have Barbara. We even have more dendro characters than hydro. That feels weird AF. But it's fine. Okay. Yeah, it was pretty fun. Oh man. Oops. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here today. I hope you enjoy it. Um, let me just open here something. Let me just confirm something. Uh, uh, okay. Well, <clears throat> Thank you so much for being here. Join our house, join our Discord channel. We are always there communicating and telling things and you can know more about what's going to happen next and all of those things. If you want to support me, follow on my Patreon. We have a lot of projects that are that will uh, be developed, especially when I get time. <laughs> but anyways, if you want to see me doing the daily commissions, talking more personally about my life and anyway, and more things and if you want to support me in any means and have special tires on discord channel and see and have special things please join our patreon well and thank you all for my patrons magiare jolanda q vimora and my candle thank you so much for being here and staying here on my patreon i love you guys so much <laughs> and thank you for interacting uh with all of this well and i hope i see you on the next stream. Thank you all so much that we're here. <laughs> Kokomi will have a return. I need Kokomi. Like I'm wanting her since I saw the the, the, the her teaser or the the, the the demos, bro. Damn. Ooh. Bye.